Can y'all see me? I am, uh... We're, we're back with Final Fantasy XI. Hello, everybody. The last 15 minutes of my life have been... chaotic. <laughs> like, right... <laughs> let me let me tell you a brief story. Um, also, the, my I feel like my camera thing is not going to be working as well today because... I, uh... Well, because of reasons I will explain right now, which is my cat decided to bite the corner of my main monitor, and so now my monitor does not work. <laughs> and so I'm now playing on my tiny side monitor and I cannot see OBS. Uh, so I, I do have the stream preview up on my uh, laptop. So I can kind of see what's going on, but we're we're working with some scuff today because my 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 cat decided to destroy five hundred dollars right in front of me. <laughs> the show must go on. I still I still love my cat, darn it! But I I wish he hadn't bitten my monitor right before I started streaming. He could have at least waited after I started or after I ended my stream. But here we are. Hello, Wizvander. <laughs> I hope your day's going better than mine. Uh, I did, I did bind to a respawn point. I did that immediately after uh, the the GM actually did not get to me 
in, until the day after I streamed last time. Um, but as soon as I did, I, I ran to this home point. I'm gonna do it again for good measure. Set this as current home point. So this is what you're supposed to do. Yes. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm playing on a tiny monitor. My tiny side monitor that I usually use just to like look at OBS, but uh, we're working with that as our main monitor today. Uh, and so like all my stuff's in like a weird spot, like my camera's in like a weird spot and all that stuff, but hopefully not to, not to uh, think of it as practice for if and when your partner have kids or perhaps a warning against having kids. I mean, I sure hope that a human child will not climb up onto my computer desk and bite my monitor, but who knows? Maybe that's a thing that human kids would do too. Uh, cat, cats are kind of interesting. I've, he I've heard them described as basically human toddlers, but with the ability to climb and jump into high places. So it's like they don't have thumbs, but they can they can get into places. So uh, the, the pros and cons are there for sure. <laughs> but yeah, I, I mean, I'm you know, like it happens. I'm not I'm not that upset. I was just very bamboozled. I mean, it is kind of upsetting to have to, you know, drop the cash for a new monitor, but, um, you know, what happens. I'll figure it out. I, I need to take a look at my warranty and st see maybe if cat bites are covered. I don't know. One can hope. Um, all right, we're back. We're back with Final Fantasy 11. Yay. So I, I've emerged out of the void. Uh, if you remember last time I was, um, uh, I died and I got stuck in a place that I could not get out of because I had not set like a respawn point. But I've done that now, a GM helped me out, thankfully. I also uh, played around a lot with the, um, uh, like the setting. So I think the text is a nicer size to look at, hopefully. Um, I also did this fancy thing where you can like split the, split the chat box into like two different sections. So I have my like, I have my like NPC dialogue and like and like system dialogue on on the on the left side, and then I have like general world chat on the right side, which I can hide with with Twitch chat. Um, I got I downloaded this like fancy fancy like HD map pack. Oops, I do not want to log out. Log out. After all I've been through, no. Oops, I should move this. This mini-map is not in the right spot. Hold on. Move you slightly over here. Um, but I downloaded like a high, like an HD map. Like, look at this. It's so HD. Um, yeah, so I think I figured some stuff out. Uh, and then last time I was on, I, I was kind of just running around, like trying to figure out how to play the actual game. Cheating. <laughs> I'm cheating. I I just want to be able to see where I'm going. Um, but uh, yeah, last time I was just kind of running around trying to f get oriented, and then we had some uh, we had some um, Final Fantasy XI experts come in, and they kind of guided me in the right direction. And they did tell me that uh, apparently my quests, like I, I was like wondering how to get into the story, um, and it turns out like my quests are hidden in a in a. In a, in a side menu. So I've got, I got some quests here. They just don't show up like on the, you know, on the side. So here's my like first step forward. This is like the tutorial mission. So uh, I can try to do that. Um, but yeah, why don't we do a couple of quests today and see if we can maybe get into the story, meet some, meet some NPCs and stuff. I don't, I don't know. What does this game have to offer story-wise? I don't know. I want to find out. You must play old RPGs with everything as shitty and pixelated as possible. The fact that you're playing on widescreen is enough of a crime. <laughs> this is sarcasm. Please enjoy the air. Oh, thank you. No, I, I, I understand the, the like, the like, you have to have the genuine experience. Yeah. Oh, I didn't point out the, um, see these fancy, like, I have some, like, um, I, da I, I added this, like, fancy HP bar um, right in the center of my screen. It actually looks a little bit like Final Fantasy XIV. Um, I got my XP bar and I got like a little inventory visualization. Um, my HP bar is usually like, it's like, can you see my mouse? Oh, maybe it's not captured by the OBS, but like in the, in the very bottom right corner is like where my HP is, like 
vanilla, and it's like kind of hard to see, so I like having it in the middle. Hello, Voodoo Doodler, how are you doing? I was just, uh, I'm doing all right. Actually, I'm doing pretty good, I think, all things considered. My, I, I was just telling chat the story of 15 minutes ago, which was my cat decided to bite my monitor and kill it, so it, my monitor does no, no longer works. <laughs> I'm down from two monitors to one monitor. Uh, so uh, that, 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 was, that was exciting. Hello, crazy psycho. All right. Um, I think last time I was trying to do a mission where I beat up one of these orcish, orcish fodder. So I will try to do that again. And this time if I die, I will not be in the void. <laughs> I don't know. Another possible takeaway, your cat has good bite strength. Cat needs to be put in the corner. Y he is never in the many years, like he's, he's four years old now. We've had him since he was a kitten. And he has never once tried to bite my computer stuff. Like, it was not something I had to, like, train him out of or anything, but just today he just decided he wanted to bite something and my computer, my monitor was, like, the closest thing. So, uh, that's what happened. Okay, I tried to fight these two last time, but they're kind of close together. I'm gonna try to find one that's more... Maybe I can just... Oh, oh, I'm, I'm kiting. Wait, what's happening? Why is my character walking like this? Okay. Fast blade. Oh, I have to attack. I have to be in attack. Okay. Go, get him. Fast blade, go. I do not have enough TP. Oh, okay. I'm scared. I'm like traumatized from the last time I died. What is the CTHU toys? Not good enough? Oh, what is the- oh, what is- oh, what is the cat choice not good enough? You know, he doesn't really play with toys that much. He, um, he doesn't really like to chew on toys. He likes chasing things, but yeah, he doesn't really bite things. Did I do my quest? Did I succeed? Let's see. Uh, quest. Smash the orca scouts. Bring one back one of their axes. Ah, okay. I have to give it back to that NPC. Oh, uh, I saw a, see a lot of reels of cats randomly biting technology. It must feel good or something. Yeah, I mean, it did make a very satisfying crunch for sure. Like I, I, I saw it happen in front of my eyes. It was, he likes, he was like looking at me and then, and then he just, like, I, there's a little bite mark where his fang kind of sunk into the plastic. Um, but yeah, I did immediately try to search online for, like, what do I do? My cat bit my screen. And the consensus is your monitor is done, donezo. It is probably not a fixable thing. Um, and also, like... There isn't really a good solution for protecting your monitors from from cat bites, apparently. So uh, I don't know. There's not like you can't go on Amazon and be like, get like a silicone like a silicone rubber case for your computer monitor. Like that sort of thing doesn't exist, apparently. Who gave me this quest? It was one of these guys, I think. Was it you? No. Who gave me this quest? How do I know? Who gave me the quest? Um, hey Greg! I enjoy stories and I enjoy art. Not too sure about this JoJo business though. Well, I hope you I hope you get to uh, get to know and enjoy the JoJo. Can I interest you in some magical maps? No. Who gave me this quest? Was it you? Welcome to the deeds of heroism. Claim a reward. No. Was it you, Roledian? Oh, a cutscene. Buy, le buy a less delicious monitor next time. That's probably the... That's probably the right choice. What will I do? Pick it up, watch and wait, walk away. Wait, what am I looking at? I'll pick it up. What is it? What's happening? Will I ever be able to show my beautiful yet shamed face to my superiors again? Okay, the okay, I think this is a new quest. <laughs> I oh my, what a stunning coincidence. I had long given up on the hope 
of bumping into someone that satisfied that tall list of requirements. You would not happen to be knowledgeable about the subject of records of eminence, would you? Uh, I'm not, because I'm a new player. Completely understandable. I myself had not heard of this system until I was charged with disseminating information on it to the masses. Interestingly enough, this conversation is undeniable proof that you've already begun to participate in records of eminence. As you will see in this mandate, um, manual, it says, set the first objective from the objective list and everything. As you know, you've cleared this first objective with flying colors. In honor of your accomplishment, I would like to present you with a memorandal. What is that? The animations look very similar to Final Fantasy XIV. It stinks up from nowhere like an assassin and it stares with such creepy intensity that you cannot help but, uh, think how adorable it is. Do you think it's listening? Each time you clear an objective, the details are recorded within the frame of this eerie doll. On a brighter note, you also receive a quantified measured measure of your eminence, termed sparks. Okay. Oh, of course, I as well cannot stand how that doll stares daggers into the depths of my soul. At least its inventor was magnanimous enough to bestow it with this special function. She's clapping. She's clapping at it. Clap on, clap off. Amazing, is it not? I hear it is all attributed, attributable to an astral patina. Sadly, I do not understand much more about it than that. What I do know is that your recipe to, for success is to set your objectives periodically. That way, you can complete them while on your adventures and garner as many sparks as possible. Moreover, some objectives only appear after you complete a certain amount of others. There is always a chance you will be surprised when you check. In the event you have forgotten how to set objectives, go to the objective list under Records of Eminence section of the quest menu. From there, you can simply pick those most suited to your current undertakings. I suggest partaking in a variety of objectives, including the ones that may be repeated. Then, when you accrue a sufficient amount of eminence, come to me or one of my friends. We have many a reward stockpiled and ready to enter your veteran hands. In summation, with benefits more inflated than even the Royal Guard's sense of self-worth and absolutely no downside, why would you not give this a shot? Oh, she like marketing? She's like a... She's marketing to me. Oh, and as that memoranda has irrevocably bonded to you, there's no need to return it. All we can do with it is throw it to the Wendigos if you don't keep it. Okay. Invisible eyes upon you cause... Oh wait, this is not her. This is like... A narrator, invisible eyes upon you cause the hairs on the back of your neck to rise. What's happening? Oh, the doll's looking at me? Okay, so I clap for it to appear. This is so weird already. <laughs> I'm, I'm like desperately clapping to make it go away. Why is she clapping? She made it appear again. Why would she do that? Yeah, I did not agree to win the ghost. Okay, that was weird. I don't think you were the one that I- Were you the one that gave me the quest? Oh my god, I leveled up for some reason. Why did I level up suddenly? Who gave me this quest? Does it say? I keep opening the wrong... Uh... Current quest. No, not that one. Missions. I was trying to do a mission. Smash the orcish guy. Mission orders. Hunt orcs lurking outside of Sandoria and bring back one of their axes. Bring it to who? Who do I bring this to? Okay, maybe I'll just do... Maybe I'll just do... Wait, I... Okay, so I forget. Missions is main story quest. And quests are just like side quests, I guess. Objective list. Tutorial. Basics. First step forward. Number required. Oh, did I did I accomplish this? I did. No, I didn't. How do I tell if I completed it? Oh god. Okay, I did talk to her. So now I can set this objective. Examine a field manual and undertake a field of valor training regime. Field managers can be found near the entrances to outposts. Oh my goodness. Where's the- where's an outpost? Is this an outpost? Am I in an outpost? Fieldman. Oh, 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 I saw one. I saw one floating in the field. I remember now. There was like a book floating outside. 
Um, but yeah, chat, what do I, how do I protect my monitor for my cat? <laughs> Anybody have any ideas? New challenge, what? Time limited records of emission, vanquish lizards. Da, 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 da. Oh, man, there's quite, like, I'm just getting quests without asking for them. Okay, I will review the current training regime. Members of the worm family. Do I need to start a different training regime? Lizards. Experience yielding lizards. Oh, okay. I have, to, I have to start a new training regime. I understand. Maybe the outpost is metaphorical. Can you put something gross tasting on your monitor? Yeah, I, I thought about... Um, I thought about doing that because you can buy these like bitter sprays that you can put onto things, but I don't know how to. I don't know. Will it be like stinky <laughs> or like sticky? Will it be like wet on my monitor? I don't know if I want that. Okay, I gotta. I gotta go. Oh, I did the quest. I, I also thought about buying one of those, um... Uh... You know those, like, baby-proofing things? It's a strange problem, yeah. It's, uh, not something I thought I would have to deal with. Uh, but you know those, like, baby-proofing things? Like, when you get, like, a small toddler and then you want to protect them from, like, bumping into, I don't know, sharp, like, table corners or something? You know, and you can buy these like strips of like rubber. Like maybe I should buy some of that and like glue it onto my monitor somehow. I don't know. Will that ruin the monitor? I guess it won't ruin it any more than my cat biting the monitor. Hello, loading list. You only need to kill two more worms to have finished the one you canceled. Yeah, I know. But I, I, did, I wanted to, I don't know. I wanted to just get the quest done. All right. Die, worm. By the way, welcome, loading list. Are you a Final Fantasy XI veteran? Whoa, that tunnel worm can cast magic spells. That's scary. I need somebody that can hit me for some HP so that I can recover to complete the quest. Where are the worms? I must summon the worms. will yodel to them and call them to me. Where are the worms? I killed them all last time. Since launch? Oh, dang. Oh, see, so you, and, and you've been playing it, uh, like, regularly the whole time? That's wild. That's cool. Okay. I'm still, like, so not used to it. What? It's gone. Okay, this one. Attack. Go! Okay. And then now, to complete my quest, I can heal. I think. Okay. Did that do it? Or do I need to type slash heal? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh god, the buttons. Um, what is, what is your favorite thing about Final Fantasy XI? I, I literally have only, this is like my third hour playing. <laughs> heal without using magic. Oh, slash heal, okay. Okay, maybe I didn't do it correctly. Let's try this. Hello, small rabbit. Please attack me. It takes 10 seconds to get an HP tick up. Oh. Okay. I have to be patient. Okay, this rabbit is not strong enough. <laughs> um, ooh, tunnel worm. Hello, tunnel worm. 
die. I've only joined an FF streams to say Joe's story point puns how the game so far. Okay, so then let me slash heal. I do the thing, and then I will wait. Oh, but I'm not I'm not losing enough HP for it to. Okay, I need to I need to get more damage. <laughs> Where are those orcs? Um, maybe a, a cheap a decoy monitor, a tiny monitor for my cat to bite on. Um, the game's the game is nice. Like I I did not know anything about it. Um, it's it the UI is a bit different from what I'm used to, I guess, in modern games. So like. I don't want to kite this one over here so that that one doesn't get at me like last time. Um, but uh, you know what? Once I'm I'm kind of getting used to the uh, the weird UI stuff, and it looks like there's actually quite a number of like add-ons that the community has made. Like like I really like this um, HP and MP stats and like the XP bar add-on that I have, so the it's more front and center. Um, and I have this, like, enemy HP thing. Ow. Um. So, you know, there's some stuff that makes it a little bit more... More... Uh, a little bit easier for somebody who, like me, who's more used to modern games. Uh, but yeah. I think it's actually... I don't know. Extremely... It's reputation of being extremely slow in its early release. Ah, yeah, I, I've heard it's extremely grindy. I that that is one reason why I decided to play on a private server because I felt like I don't know for someone who just wants to take try a taste of the game. Um. Oh, okay, I did it! Yay! Ah, oh, that beautiful fanfare. I need it. What's next in my adventure? I keep pressing the wrong <laughs> menu button. Uh, yeah, but um, there's a lot of similarities. Uh, uh, like, I'm really familiar with Final Fantasy XIV, as you all probably know, but I it, it, there's a lot of um, interesting similarities. You can definitely see the, like, the influence of Final Fantasy XI on fourteen, which is pretty, pretty, pretty fun. Just, like, I, I think the way the characters are designed and, like, the way they animate... Um, is very, very similar. It feels very familiar, surprisingly. Vanquish one enemy. Defeat one monster outside of a city. Make sure to have some food and signet cast upon you. Is, is that required for the quest, or can I just fight an enemy? Fight this guy. I'm powerful enough to take you on, I think. Go! Go. Yeah. Wanna turn that question mark off? Do I? I is it um I I've heard that it's like a marker of like a newbie. And I kinda wanna make sure that I I I show myself as a newbie. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna die! Oh! I did, but I'm not going to go back to the void this time. But yeah, I don't know. Like, is, is it is it bad to have it on? I don't know much about the like the the etiquette. Uh, I don't know. I want I want people to know that I'm a newbie because if they then if they see me that I'm acting really stupid, then I can just be like, I I don't know what I'm doing, you know? Hey, Alexander Dean, how's it going? How are you? Man, I love this music. This, this area's music is so great. Okay, I will vanquish one easy enemy. Come here, you rabbit. And speaking, speaking of running around in the grass, I, I went hiking today because um, my work had like a little event for all of our interns. So we took them on like a like a hike through through San Francisco. Um, I did it. 
Uh, so I went outside. I was outside for a long time. And it was fun. Uh, I got to meet a lot, get to know a lot of the interns. Examine a grounds tome and undertake a grounds of valor training regime. The grounds tomes can be found near the entrances to dungeons. Okay. Okay, so now I need to I need to figure out where to find the dungeon. Check mobs as you go further out. Get at it. Gamer Beeb is here visiting. She loved her browser nativity. Yay! Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope I hope you guys are having fun hanging out. Um I'm I'm so glad that the poster got to you in time. Excellent. Yeah, she she messaged me as well, um, letting me know. So yeah! I'm glad you guys are hanging out, too. I hope you have a lot of fun. Every time I hear about your job's extracurricular activities, I'm always in awe. I remember that you mentioned that a model for drawing went there one day, even. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, there's some benefits, I think, to... I, I work at a large tech company, and, like, some of the benefits are, um, you know, things like that. Is this a dungeon? This icon looks dungeon-like, maybe. It, it looks like there's a little book there, so I'm gonna try going that direction. Let's go, okay, south, southwest. Um, probably be a bit before you get that one. Oh, uh, okay. Out that's an outpost? Oh, dang. Let me go look at the map again. Oh, it says right here, outpost. I can read maps. Nightwell. Maybe I'll just run around. That's an outpost. That's a city. Huh. Okay, well, let's try, um... This is Oubliette Exit? Should I go to the exit? I don't know. Let's follow the trail. Hopefully you didn't haze them too hard. Nah. I mean, um, it was, it's not that hard of a hike, actually. I, I've, done, I've done it a couple times before. It's, we, we do the same thing for our interns every year. Um, but I haven't been on it since, like, I don't know, five years ago or something? Because uh, the last time I was on it was before COVID. And then after that, I, I didn't have any interns, and I feel like, I was like, I don't know, it feels weird to just show up and be like, Hi, no, none of you know who I am, I'm just gonna, like, hang out with you. <laughs> Top left is dungeon, check moms. Top left is dungeon, okay. Oops. I remember when you mentioned, uh, oh, I read that already. Check mobs. What do you mean by check mobs? What is, what does that mean? Just like, look at them? I'm sorry if that's a dumb question. Uh, top, you said top left. Okay, up here. Ah, Gaba, Gels, Gelspa, Gelspa Outpost. Okay, Northwest. Northwest. Examine with command menu to get difficulty. Ah. Wait, command, examine, wait, let me try. Where is my test subject? Come here so I can learn how to use the UI. Carrion worm. Okay, menu, check. Oh, okay, I saw it for a split second before the, before the worm disappeared. I see. Orcish grappler, you look scary, check. Orcish Grappler seems like an even match. It seems to have low evasion but high defense. Whoa, that is a much wordier... wordier, um... description than I was expecting. I was expecting, like, a level or something. <laughs> Should I try? Should I try killing this? I'll try. I no longer fear death! I no longer fear death! Where are you going?! Oh no, I'm scared. I'm here. I no longer fear death. Go. No? <laughs> uh oh. Oh god! Oh man! Disengage! Disengage! Run! Run! <laughs> the game told me it was an even match! Did I read it wrong? Anything above decent will be difficult? Uh oh. Okay. Is it gone? Is it still following me? Oh my god! When will it give up? It lies? <laughs> like, why would the game lie to me? 
Why would the game lie to me? Okay, so should I not like go past like if I okay, so I see you're you're asking me to check mobs because it gives me a sense of like it's still following me! Leave me alone! I said I'm I I'm sorry. Um Okay, so like I like I shouldn't venture further than the mobs that I am that I am able to kill. Is kind of what you're saying. So so I'm not ready for the dungeon. Like if I cannot beat the mobs on the way to the dungeon, I'm not ready for the dungeon. Is that is that accurate? He's not stopping till you die. I'm gonna I've I've made it. <laughs> oh, that's so scary that they chase you. That's scary that they chase you to the ends of the earth. Oh god, that's horrifying. Whoops. Okay. Well, in that case, um, I could level. I could also maybe do some like quests, like side quests. There was that kid that said he lost his dad. So I could go help him. Wabbits and worms for a little while. Ah, okay. Oh man, I, oh, I could have grind, grinded off stream then. Maybe I should have done that. Imagine you leave and they're right back to chasing you. That's so scary. Okay, let me go find that kid's dad. Where was he even? Wait, so a uh, question for the uh, the Final Fantasy XI folks. So is there no way to see like which which NPCs have quests? You just have to like talk to them and see? Is that... Is, is there no other way to like see what content there is on the in the map? Start your trust quest from from Rose. Oops, I keep pressing the wrong button. Yeah, I have. Okay, you, uh, records of eminence, right? What's an experience yielding lizard? <laughs> so I can't do that because I'm not strong enough. Uh, trust quest. He said, "I don't have trust quests. Are they? Uh, are they? Uh, are they a uh, category that will show up? Tutorial. Tutorial. Missions. Not in game for regular NPCs." Wiki is basically required for those. Oh dang! Okay, so you gotta, you gotta, you gotta. Oh, this call forth an. Uh, no. Oh, okay, so I can just skip this one, I guess. Um. Okay, I see, I see. Basic. Okay, I see. Okay, I don't have to do them in order. That is, that makes sense. Um, I already forgot what I. Oh, you can do more than you can have more than one, accepted at a time. Okay. G9 in Maura? Oh, that's not here, is it? Okay, maybe I'll do something else. Call forth an alter ego. Speaking to one of the following NPCs, Gondabar Gondabad, Southern Sandoria, L6. That seems close. L6. 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 L. <laughs> L. L6. Okay, kind of over there, kind of near Lion Square. Okay. Let me go. I will go. Mog House. Mog House. Turn left. That's okay. I got the map. I'll find it. Don't worry about it. I can. I can read maps. L6. Yeah. I'm going there. I think. Are these like functional? Are these functional buildings? No, they're not. The store taunts me. It claims clothing fashion, but I cannot buy any fashion. Oh, are these maybe like? Are these are these like guilds? Maybe the guild areas? I don't know. 
Oh, you have to target the door. Eh, okay. Oh! Oh, okay, so it's not even a loading zone. You just have to, like, do an action to open it. Uh, okay, cool. Nice house you got here. Very cool. It's kind of... It feels a little big. Oh, God. I have to open the door manually. Some are facades, though. Okay. Got it. Get gear from Sparks. Them places are highway robbery. <laughs> It's the big city, am I right? I forgot where I was. Oh, Gondabard, you! There's a, why is there a sparkly thing here? I step into the sparkly thing. Do I talk to the sparkly thing? Mystic Retriever. Oh, I'll just talk to you. I don't want to mess with. Oh! <laughs> I am uncomfortably close! Hail, friend! No need to be so fleet of foot. Come, let me impart upon you a tantalizing morsel of information. A freshly hatched adventurer such as yourself could surely appreciate the offer I'm about to lay forth for your consideration. I, Gondabard, Gondabod? Gondabod, am an esteemed member of the storied Juno Institute of Magical Studies. Mayhap I am repeating what you already know, but Juno is a grand city far to the southeast of here that connects the Quan and Mindari Mindarcha continents. The leading council has bid me come to this fair land of Sandoria with a most sacred mission. Several moons past, our famed institute held a lavish symposium at which we made privy to the public information about a new form of magic. These new forms of incantations, which we call trust, would prove a mighty boon of adventures of your caliber. A bevy of new experiences await should you choose to participate in this grand experiment. Would you embark on a journey to this fresh new world? Yes. I want friends! I want virtual friends! How fortuitous! I swear by every gray hair on this head that you will not regret it. That's weird. You don't need to do that, sir. It's quite all right. Your first task is to head to the city gates in northern Sandoria. There you will find someone engaged in the running of Ballista, a type of mock skirmish. Some call him by the moniker of the Grand Hero of Sandoria. If you've already surmised, experimental magic may have unknown effects on the world, so he's very careful to ensure the safety of everyone involved. In fact, he is so dedicated to this goal that he himself stepped up as the nation's first participant in the program. The other two grand nations, Bastok and Windurst, have also seen others step up to try their hand at this wonderful manifestation of the arcade. He has zero gray hairs, I know! Oh wait, maybe he was sassing. Maybe he was calling attention to how young and spry he is but we will leave those journeys for a, a later date. Your first step starts here at Sandoria, where you will garner the services of one of Vanna Diel's most storied heroes. Okay. Stupendous. Under my expert tutelage here in Sandoria, you will surely grasp the basics of trust in no time. Take this letter of introduction with you and head to Ranpair Gate in Northern Sandoria. To get to Northern Sandoria, you must first head west of here, the north towards Victory Square. Okay, so back where I came, basically. After reaching Northern Sandoria, you are to make for Ranpair Gate. Once there, seek out Exen, Exen Mill, and pray do not affront him in any fashion. The words of a hero such as he carry unmatched weight in this land. I got a Red Institute card. Okay, thank you. Goodbye. Where are all these people? Are you one of those adventurers? Are you an adventurer? Not today. I guess I am. Not today. I knew it to be so. This badge was... Oh, I'm getting a thing. They... Oh, they put a badge on me. Leader of Salahim Sentinels, a snarling wildcat. Under the authorization of her Imperial Majesty... Wait, I'm being inducted to a cult or something. What? Well respected company that specializes in training and dispatching mercenaries for the defense of the Ot Ergen Empire. We have a myriad of well paying missions ready for any able bodied adventurer, but my speech grows over long. My dauntless commander has bid me take ship to this bountiful kingdom and dazzle the citizenry with the sentinel splendor, and so I shall. Wha Did I. <laughs> I feel like I just got caught. You know, like. Uh, I'm not as bad about this as now, but you know how, like, sometimes you go to, like, a grocery store or something and there's somebody outside that's like... 
let me tell you about like donating to this, I don't know, like nature reserve or something. And then they're like, come on, do you have a moment of your time? And I used to be like, oh, okay, sure. Cause I used to be like, oh, I'll just, yeah, I, I can talk to you for a little while. I feel kind of bad everyone's ignoring you. And then I would like go talk to them. And then they would just be like, okay, no, blah, 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 blah. And they're like very charismatic. And they talk to you and just be like, and so isn't that awful? Don't you want to help? And I'd be like, I, I guess. And then I'd be like, okay, give me $50. I'm like, okay. <laughs> you must have made eye contact. Yeah, and then the Pokemon like battle music starts just like, da -da 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 -da. a social encounter started. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. I highly recommend going to BG Wiki and clicking on the leveling guide. Mmm. That quest is the start of getting to White White Gate for treasures. Storylines. I don't know what that means. But I, I do understand the meaning of going to BG Wiki and looking up a leveling guide. I can do that. Um Quick Start Quick Start Level 1 to 119 guide? <laughs> That doesn't sound very fast. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh man, I'm gonna have to like read this later. <laughs> but I, I can I can skip ahead, I think. Floating books, login. Oh my gosh. This would have been beneficial to read perhaps before stream. <laughs> but thank you for the resource. It's, it, it looks very, very helpful. Uh, what was I doing? I was looking for a guy. I was going to Ballista. Lista. White Gate is the main city in third expansion. 20 years of game to digest. Yeah, I mean, it's still it's still going, right? Uh, he said Ballista. Oh, Rampair Gate. Rampair Gate is where I'm supposed to be going. I so I guess somewhere here. OK, I go this way. Um. Yeah, but that, I mean, that's impressive though, right? Like a game lasting so long. There's not, there's not many, whoops, wrong. Almost went into somebody's house. Uh, there's not a lot of games that are that old, really. That like are still, you know, have a, have a community around them. What are all these people? I want to talk to all of them. Let's take a sampling. Who are you? These sluice gates divide Northern Sandoria into two parts. Okay, we got some sluice gate lore. Excellent. Click on all of them HP crystal. Oh yeah, I have to like, I have to like collect them, right? As uh, because they're teleport points. Did I pass one? They're, they're teleport points, right? Uh, gosh. Okay, well I, I'm sure I will come back this way. Okay, okay, okay. I understand. How much to remember? Um, what what have been the biggest changes since the game started to like now? Cause I'm sure it's changed a lot. Um, and I'm sure a lot of the changes were like, I know I'm I'm sure there've been popular changes and not popular changes. Have there been like, I don't know what what were like major turning points in like Final Fantasy XI history? I'm really curious. Uh, map. I am in the wrong part. This way. Also can set them as where you go back to when you die. Yes, I learned that lesson the hard way when my first stream <laughs> last week where I did not set a home point and I had to wait for the GM to rescue me from like this, this like purgatory place that I could not move from. Okay, I'm supposed to talk to, I have already forgotten the man's name. Ex oh, Exenmil, you, you look, Hero like. <gasps> Cutscene! I am Exenmil M. R. Argiat, overseer of all conflict related matters. Do I do like a hot anime guy voice? I see, you wish, you, you wish to try your hand at trust. In bygone times, I might have said that adventurers were to be kept at an arm's distance, like the deranged mother of one's partner. What? <laughs> what? Exenmil, you got... Do you... Do you need to talk? Are you okay? 
Yet when I choose to revive the ancient traditions of conflict and ballista, it was you, the adventurers, who heeded the call to battle. As such, I shall permit you to engage in the trust witch ritual with me. You are not aware of what the trust magic is? What, do we gotta, what? Do I gotta give you a hug or something? What? Sometimes I wonder if Gondabod's head is filled with naught but cobwebs. The trust ritual draws forth energy from ardent bonds of trust and camaraderie as are forged betwixt brothers in arms upon the battlefield. To cut to the quick, if a strong bond exists between the two of us, you will be able to summon an alter ego of me. This sounds like a fan fiction setup. Indeed, I could drive your foes into the sea as I did the orcs of Razoa. The problem is, I could hardly pick you out of a lineup of similarly built individuals. Yes, I'm ready to commit to the ritual. Wait, so do you... Do you... Come, take my hand and concentrate on the bonds that the two of us have forged. So like, nothing? <laughs> oh, here I... Oh, I'm sitting! I'm so... I'm bonding. I have to fall backwards <laughs> into his arms. Oh! My god. Disgraceful! Hmm? No, I'm not displeased. I'm rather pleasantly surprised at her joint success. What is disgraceful is the very thought that there could be two of me. How can my power be unmatched when there are two Exxon Mills? Think of it, Joju Story. Think of the possibilities this magic could open up if only we harness it properly. A whole army of Exxon Mills could even... Yes, the orc empire would be like a prostrate babe crying out for its mother's milk. I almost said the other word. That would have been bad. Ha ha ha, would you fancy that? Tonight we drink, tomorrow we vanquish. I'm warming to the idea of this trust more and more. Ha ha, oh god. <laughs> Though I must admit, I barely expected success to come so easily. I triumphed in the bonding only once before. It was with my old friend Rahal, leader of the Royal Knights, but all those who came after have failed spectacularly. But that man can be so infuriating. Go here, hold your sword like this, turn 90 degrees and touch your nose. Make sure you do not fall into the same trap. Oh my god. In commemoration of this monumental event, I hereby present you with a scroll containing all we have achieved. Using this should enable you to summon my alter ego. I advise you to try your hand at your nearest convenience. Outside of town, that is. May I suggest East or West Ronfar? They are both nearby and provide ideal conditions for you to try out this newfound power. When you are finished, return here and inform me as to how you are progressing. Okay. I learned to trust eggs and milk. Oh, so I can I can add it to my I can add it to my hot bar, my macros. Yes, is that what I can do? Edit macro. Um. Oh, this is the book I have open. Confirm. Maybe I'll put it here. You can also set the oh. Click on the map section to use the wide scan ability. It pulls up all the NPCs in the zone and you can look over them and track one. Oh, okay. So like if a quest is like, you should talk to Mr. Booby Man. You can be like, where's Booby Man? Ah, okay. Like this, that's handy. Okay, cool. Got it. What are these markers? What is this? Oh, it, maybe th these are custom. Okay, I see. Uh, lots of QL and many avenues for leveling added in later years was a big departure from the first eight or so years of game and expansions. Yeah, like somebody else was mentioning, and I remember hearing this too, like around the time when I, I had some friends playing it when it first came out, um, that it was like very, very slow and grindy, um, which, which didn't appeal to me, so I, n I never got into it, but... Yeah, maybe it sounds like they they uh, um, yeah maybe added different options. Oh, I need to know. Uh, I need to know the like text to type. <laughs> how do I? Do I gotta like look this up on the wiki too? Like how to do a command? Uh, let me see. Magic. Trust. Oh, I cast on myself. Cannot fall, call forth. Eco. Okay, okay, got it. 
Um, or list of commands. Works outside also for mobs. Ah, okay. Oh, so I'm, if I'm looking for like a particular type of monster. That's cool. Wait, so is this part of my... Ah, I keep pressing the wrong... Uh, Man, I love checking stuff off a list. Okay, so I have to do it and then come back. Okay. Okay, is this outside? Looks outside. Can type slash question mark for list of commands, but wide scan isn't one, I don't think. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. I see. Where's my mouse? Oops. Uh, slash question mark. Eh. Wait, this is a stupid question. How do I scroll my... <laughs> How do I scroll my... How do I scroll? Word slash his name in... in... Oh! Oh! F and enter? F? Oh! Ah! Oh, go back to where you were. Oh! F? F, enter. Oh! Okay. That was scary. Oh, okay, I see. Cool. Or triangle and control. Triangle opens my uh, my like my menu. Oh, okay. This is not in alphabetical order, which is perhaps a problem. But you say it's slash forward slash and his name. Okay. Click on yourself. I feel like I'm learning like magic, magic incantations from you guys. Click on myself. Okay. Click on myself. Trust. XML. Ah, oh, okay. So that's, that's an easy way to get there too. I could do this or I could do this. Okay. But I guess it's also, will this show up in like a, well, I guess I could just do this. Will this show up in a battle? Battle context. Whoa. Oh, I have like a little party, party UI. Look at him. Look at my handsome boy. <laughs> That I am, I'm, I guess I'm friends with him, but like not really. Okay. Oh, I, I've been awarded a cipher of Valeneral's alter ego. Oh, he made, he does like dialogue. Is that an item? Oh, I can't see anything. I now attack something. Hold on. Let me move this over to like a place. What is a cipher of... Do I just have it? No. Wait, do I need to talk to the guy? Let me let me show him what I have done. Will he go away? Oh, will my guy go away when I go back into town? Is he gone? He's gone. My, my man has disappeared. He's gone forever. Wait, where's my guy? I want to tell him how I did. Where are you? This music reminds me a lot of the tavern music in Skyrim. I wonder if this was an inspiration. Oh, maybe. Though I think, um, if I'm not mistaken, hasn't the, the, the person who did Skyrim, how did things go? Swimmingly, drowningly. <laughs> it went well. A little bit of floundering. Um, but didn't, hasn't the guy that, that composed the Skyrim music done the music for like all the Elder Scrolls? Like, he's been doing- I think he's been composing for them for, like, a really long time. I might be wrong about that. Uh, it was wonderful to hear that you are getting along well with my alter ego. Good things come in three, so one more positive thing must await you yet. <laughs> I don't know if I like this guy. The Red Institute card I've bequeathed to you will surely be of interest to Gondabad. He can tell you more. And please, treat my alter ego well. Don't go barking inane orders like Rahal did. All of us involved in this grand experiment are attempting to figure out the exact methodology behind it. This is bigger than Sandoria. The nations of Bastok and Windurst are serious as we are. This Sandoria trust permit is intended not just for your own betterment, but for the betterment of us all. Go forth and discover all there is to be learned. While I have your attention, Kirilla of the Temple Knights is also participating in this initiative. I must warn you, however, that she has little time for those who have done her no favors. I highly doubt she would consent to undergoing the ritual with you. 
Increase your reputation around Vanadiel and do all you can for Sandoria first. Hmm? You wish to know where Kirilla is anyway? I don't need to. Somebody told me about Widescan. Hee hee hee. Why, she can be found in Chateau de Uruguayle, located to the northeast of here. However, I would not expect the guards there to let you pass. I must bid you adieu. May glory shine upon you and on the grand nation of Sandoria. Yee. Okay, so I gotta go back to that guy. I'm now able to call multiple alter egos. I know the same guy writes all the books in the Elder Scrolls games. Oh. Yeah, I think it's I think it's uh, the same composer. I'm, I'm fairly certain. Don't quote me on that, though. Oh, a book. Hello. Survival guide. Okay. I have to remember. Why are there floating books? <laughs> nice, we got some more Final Fantasy XI gamers. Yeah, 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 they're teaching me things. I, 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 I hope it's fun watching me, like, <laughs> explore. <gasps> There's a small child! Hello, small child. Um, you're still bigger than me, though. Kumazoli. I wish that all of Sandoria was full of pretty flowers. Flowers. I wonder if ev every everybody knows about gar gardening. <laughs> hey there, miss. Hey there, miss. Have you heard? Have you? What are you talking about? Do you really want to know? Really, really? Listen, I know the secrets of gardening. What do you want to know? What do you want to know? Oh. Um. Okay, this is a. Is this like a skill? Take a seed, plant it in a fire pot, and leave the rest here, Moogle. That's gardening. Okay, is my Moogle paid? Do they have benefits? And then, after a while, a pretty flower blooms. And then, and then, the flower tur turns. <laughs> I feel like they put the rolling R's in like, not the right places. Into fruit, and you can get all kinds of neat stuff. Not R rolling. No, I can do it, but it's it's weird. Like they put the rolling R into there, like there, <laughs> there. You know, like you don't normally even pronounce the like the R the R part. Oops, I was thinking about all that delicious fruit. Purr. Okay, I'll, I'll come back to gardening later. Meow. Okay. Meow. <laughs> You're not wrong. I just tried it. That. Yeah, it's like kind of. It's hard on the mouth. Doesn't doesn't quite work out. <laughs> My roommate's sitting here. Is that that's a warp book also? Oh, the books are warpy. Can warp you places? I see. Oh, cause can you not just like? Okay, I'm so used to the I'm so used to the luxuries of Final Fantasy fourteen. So you can't just like warp. Like I can't just go to the map and like warp around, right? Like I have to. Right, okay, yeah, I can't choose, like, warp points. I see. Okay. Okay, so the book, I, I, I think you're saying the book is, I can, I can fast travel using the book, perhaps. Um. Some books for buffs, warps, and temp items. Others have objectives for mobs to kill. Bonus XP, I think. Been a while. Ah. Okay. So does does Final Fantasy XI still get a lot of new new players here and there? Like I feel like um, I I did a little bit of poking around. Oh, I gotta pick up this crystal point. Um, I mean I, I I I did a little bit of poking around, like trying to you know figure out what private server to go on. Um, but a lot of the especially for the private server. Oh, am I even going the right direction? I think so. Um, even for the private server, like, it seems like a lot of the people who play are, like, people who had played in the past and just kind of want to get back into it again. Rather than people who are like, I just want to try it. I don't know. That, that seemed, that was my Im impression from just, like, looking at the Discord and, and stuff. But, um, oh, I gotta get that crystal, too. Did I set my home point this time? I did. <laughs> There's no the G the GM was probably very disappointed with me when I made that second when I made that second post. It's the Shadow Realm. <laughs> I got out of the Shadow Realm. Y Yugi will not banish me. Yami Yugi will not banish me. 
again. Uh, do you require an explanation as to what a trust is? Oh, I guess I thought I was supposed to go talk to him, but I guess not. Uh, all right, what's my next quest? It comes and goes, I see. We shall never return to the Shadow Realm, hopefully. Yeah, otherwise the, the, the GMs are gonna have to have a talk with me. Alter Ego Valnerial. Oh. Call forth an Alter Ego Valnerial. Okay. I gotta go outside. Is this outside? I think the Final Fantasy XIV crossover story pulled a good, good chunk in. Not, not sure about normal new players though. Oh yeah, that's right! Someone mentioned that last time. I, I also played the crossover and I had totally forgotten. That is house. Oh. If it happens again, we just need to pray it's a different GM. I know. Oh, hey, is this my house? I have a house? I'm a homeowner? Who are you? Ah, uh, open Mog. I don't want to open the Mog. Eh? I have, I have a home. I opened the Mog and now it's disabled, which concerns me. I can change jobs here. Ah, cool. I have a fireplace. This is like all I ever wanted. Cool. It lets other people. Oh, I do not want other people to visit. How do I how, close? Close the house. Maybe it closes when I leave. We'll lock the door. Yes, heading outside. He will be your tank. Ah, when was this added? This can't have been there at launch, right? Oh, if only they gave away houses like that IRL. Wow, my house was just like over here. That's cool. Let me let me get oriented on the map again. Okay, oh, I see, it's this residential area there, okay. Okay, let's go to the east, east to run far. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, usually they don't add they don't have houses and MMOs right away, right? Um, did they ever add houses in Ragnarok Online? I can't remember. It was... I don't know. There was a point at which I stopped playing and, like, did not keep up with all the new updates and such. Valo will also kill you as much as your enemies will? <laughs> Why? He's a double agent? Why would he do that to me? I'm just a little guy. I'm just a, I'm just a small adventurer just trying to... Just trying to adventure. Wait, so do I need to do anything to get the trust magic? Does, is he just in my trust menu? Okay, so... Trust... No, he's not in here. I, I saw that uh, item message that I got like a... Oh, this. Okay. Chanting the enigmatic script summons his alter ego to the bear side. Okay, so this... What? Use. I cannot use it. Why? Why can I not use this? Scroll inscribed a strange symbol that is so away the po poissants. The poissants. <laughs> Trade? Trade. This guy? Hello, do you want a cipher of a guy? If you're outmatched, run to the city as quickly as you can. Are you are you mocking me? That's what I did literally 30 minutes ago. No chatting while I'm on duty. Okay. Oh, back in the square. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, I understand. I see. Dang. I love having houses in MMO, but my interior decoration instinct is terrible, so I end up just hoping other people invite me to their houses. Oh my gosh, yeah. I I was lucky enough to get a house in Final Fantasy XIV, like, pretty early on. Um, and, uh, like, but I, I still, I've had it, so I've had it for literally years, and, like, I still have not decorated it at all. I just, like, dump all my furniture in there, and it's just kind of a mishmash of... I think the only thing I did once is I, um, our, our FC has, like, our guild has a, uh... Oh, can I trade to this sparkly? Oh, I can't. Mystic Retriever. My favorite dog breed. Mystic Retriever. Um... Not, you're not to trade to this guy. 
Wait, are you the wrong person to trade to? Do I have to talk to you from behind the table? No. No, no, no. I don't want... Okay. Soror Sororal love? Okay, he's just explaining things. Back at square. My square. Do I have to... Oh, do I have to use it in front of him, maybe? Items. Use. No. Sir, please give me my tank. Sir, I just... I'm just a poor adventurer that needs a tank. Click on yourself by him. Click on myself by him. Trade, aha! Trade with Gondabod, and then I give him this thingy. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh ho! You've got a cipher of Valenaral's alter ego on hand, do you? Funny story that. They're also involved in that trust initiative. I must bow my head in appreciation for all that you and your ilk have done for us. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. I have literally done nothing. I died, I died to an orc twice. Let us get down to business, you say? Use these newfound powers? Then we shall commune together. Close your eyes and let the powers of trust, friendship, and sisterly love fill every ilm of your body. That table's a bench for normal sex people. I'm, I'm 14, I know people like to hold out of the little potatoes and things like it. Yeah, I'm a little potato. I'm a, I'm a proto potato. Potato? <laughs> the one who died to orc fodder, hero of the realm, Jojo story. A marvelous spectacle if I do say so myself. Well, I'm just glad these people seem to really like me despite, nothing, despite anything. Now you owe me not one, but two. Ho ho! How great it is to have the upper hand! Oh, this is a cult. I learned trust of a All right, let's go back outside. <laughs> no time to chat. I have to look out for noobs who are running back towards the gate. <laughs> running away from enemies that are that never give up and never surrender. Okay, okay. So I have to remember a lot of important things I have to do by clicking on myself. Which is- oh, is this outside? This is outside. What is this? What is this sparkly thing? Enigmatic footprints. There appears to be a tear in the fabric of space. I'm not touching that. <laughs> hey, Betty Bok. Did you ever figure out how to close that one box? Oh, I did! I did! I did figure it out! Okay, so the problem was... Um, so that box was an add-on. And, uh... What it was it was in the wrong. Okay, so this game does not work very well if you tell it the wrong um, The wrong uh, I had my resolution my like in-game resolution set to like a different number than what my actual computer's resolution is like because I thought It was anyway. I was trying to do something and then it like made it think that the windows were in a different position than they actually were so I, when I tried to click on the X, I couldn't click on the X. Well, then once I set the resolution correctly, it was like, oh, all the you know coordinates are fine. So now, now it's all now it's all good. Hello, you are a fancy man. Level up, summon demand. <laughs> wow, summon magic in Final Fantasy has gotten really complex. Dynamis D entrance. Uh, I forgot about the window you just moved on screen. Yeah, <laughs> but yes, I was able to properly close it. Hello, are we gonna talk? It's a special valiant effort you've been awarded a cipher of Melee's alter ego. Oh, I got another one. Okay. Uh, first, let me see if I gotta set my thingy. Oh man, I wish this was easier to access. Millie, Millie Aliapo. <gasps> An Aliapo? An Aliapo of the Eorzean Aliapos? Oh my gosh. Legendary family. Now back to him again. Trade the new one. Got it. Okay, I, I'm seeing a pattern. I understand. <laughs> um, there is a, there is a, uh, there, there's a couple of Aliapos in, um, 
in Final Fantasy XIV. So I guess, I guess this is what they are referencing. That's kind of cool. Betty, did you, Betty, did you, were you here for the part when I was telling you, telling chat that my cat broke my monitor? Like I'm playing off of my tiny side monitor right now. It is very, this game is very small. Okay, no, I don't want to talk to you. Don't talk to me. Trade to Gondabod and give the cipher this. There you go. Give me a character. <laughs> oh ho, you got a cipher of Melee's alter ego on hand, do you? Oh, he's saying the same thing. Okay, okay. We shall commune together. Why do I have to commune with this guy? Why is he like a proxy communer? A friendship. Pretty much everything in 14 is from 11. Yeah, like I, I'm realizing that. There's like a lot of, a lot of, like, it is very, very, very clearly based off of this. Okay. Okay. I learned to trust Neely Aliapo. All right, what does the quest say now? I really wish I could like pin the quests to my, to my screen. I'll take, oh, call forth. Okay, let's go back outside. Luckily, she purchased the cat by extended warranty. They offer a checkout. Oh, uh, I wish. I, I ordered it from Amazon, actually. I do not know if Amazon has such a... Like, I don't even know if... Like, if I buy it from Amazon and not directly from... The place. The, the manufacturer's website. I don't, I don't know what kinds of warranty Amazon has versus other places, so I'm a little worried. Um, what was I saying about- oh, decorating houses. Um, I did once, um, gain a lot of carbuncle-themed furniture because I was doing- I was grinding for- oops. I was grinding for a- an event. And for this event, I gained a lot of, like, uh, a type of currency that I could use to buy um, a certain kind of furniture, and then I went into my guild's house and I just I decorated our, our our bottom our basement floor was empty, and then I filled it with carbuncle furniture. Really, really dastardly, I know. Hello, you look like you need to run to the bathroom. She says, "Hey, hey, I want to turn. Oh, I should move my uh, should move my." I trust dialogue to the other window. Eeeh. How do I do that again? Window, 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 window. No, config. It's in config. Windows? No, log. Log. Window one. Chat. No. Yourself? No. Brothers? No. System? No. Chat. Uh, NPC conversations in here. I did not hear er you earlier about your monitor, but that is unfortunate. He did it like he did it f like 15 minutes before I started stream too. It was kind of horrifying. Go to effects and turn that window jitter off. What window jitter? Oh, I don't know. It doesn't bother me. I think it's fine. But th th thank you for letting me know. Um, looks like I can't. Is it Unity Group? Party? Oh, all party members. Oh, I'm not sure I want to do that though. Cause what if I have to party with like regular people? <laughs> yeah, now now Marvel's just chilling. Like nothing is wrong. Uh, let's see. Wes. Beep a doo. Alter ego Tenzin. Ah. Okay. Let me set the objective, and then we go back. Once again. Tenzin. That is not, isn't, there's a character in 14 that's named Tenzin. He's in a, he's in like a side quest. Is he possibly the same person? It's okay, now you can get a better monitor, but now I'm afraid that if I get a, what if I get a more expensive, better monitor, and then Marble also breaks it immediately? <laughs> it was a swift death. It was like he 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 just like absentmindedly bit into it and then it just turned off. 
I was like, maybe I should just get the same monitor. It's it's actually cheaper now because it's been a while. Whoops. Trade. Trade. Get a decoy. <laughs> Somebody else said the exact same thing <laughs> earlier. They said get a decoy monitor. A cat-sized decoy monitor. Yeah, maybe I should just keep my my currently broken one as like a as like a marble toy. Okay, okay, communing, communing. Depends on the manufacturer. Good luck and Godspeed with that. Yeah, I hope so. I I didn't get a chance to look into it before the stream started, but I will I will look. Well, we'll we'll look at my options. All right, time to go back outside. Can I go this way? <laughs> bit into it? Yeah, my 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 cat bit into the corner of my monitor and his tooth punctured. Oh, I'm going the wrong direction? His tooth punctured my, uh, the, the LCD screen and then the LCD screen was just like, I'm done, and then it just doesn't work anymore. <laughs> Somehow he'll know which is the good monitor and buy that one, probably. He's like, this one smells cool and interesting. This old one is just like boring and not cool. I wanna buy this one. No, I, I am actually seriously thinking about getting those like rubber, rubber like baby proofing um, like edges like you put on the tables and just like taping it all around and see if that works. Prevents it. Hello, Tenzin. Come forth. Oh, I got another one. Oh, man. Oh, hey. Oh, he's a samurai. Oh, my gosh. I've heard about you, Tenzin. You are, you're in, you're in Final Fantasy <laughs> 14 later in, like, a later expansion. Whoa. Okay, we go back. Hmm. I did not realize this was, like, such a long chain of things. I need to come up with more, <laughs> more stories. What do I have? What did I do today? I went on my hike. My knees hurt. I got very badly sunburned. This is this is your this is your PSA, everybody. Please remember to wear sunscreen when you go outside for more than a couple hours. Cause I I haven't been outside for like an extended amount of time in a while, and I just like forgot to put sunscreen on, and now my body hurts. <laughs> So everyone, please take care of your take care of your skin and do not get skin cancer, please. Um, I I was careful about sunscreening my face because I wear it normally anyway. Oops, what am I doing? I wear it normally anyway, so my my like face is fine, but like my neck and my arms are like not fine. And then I and then as 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 soon as I got home. Oops. Trade. Ah! Trade. Gone to bod. As soon as I got home, I took a shower, and the shower... The shower hurt! <laughs> the shower hurt the sunburn parts. It's not a good sign. I'm finding Reddit threads about protecting PC monitors from cat- Oh, what are you finding? I, I only looked for a little bit, but mo most of the people- Most of the comments were like, just like don't let the cat on the on the desk or like don't like get rid of the cat. I was like, I can't do any of these things. Can you get a monitor with a big bezel? Maybe. It's like go go to a computer, like a hardware store and be like, do you have any monitors from like 2000? <laughs> Alright, time to summon this baby. Mount it on the wall. Yeah, I maybe. I guess that's an excuse to get a bigger monitor, per perhaps. But, uh, I don't know. Yeah, like have it pushed up against the wall, maybe, so it's less, you can't really like grasp it with the mouth. Could just get a CRT monitor. Try biting into this. Freaking indestructible, except in the face of technological advancements. I'll out an old CRT and turn it into a cat bed house. Oh my gosh, that's actually such a cute idea. <laughs> that's a cute idea. I love that. 
Let's see, trade. No, trade. I'm, I'm not, <laughs> I'm like panicking. I'm like having secondary panic about my cat biting into my monitor. Not thinking straight. Adelheid, who are you? Are you a kid detective? Whoa! No, you have like a little college grad cap. You're a school, you were a school girl? A school, a student. I, I almost said school attendee. A student. Mortarboard, yes, that's what that's called. Okay. Uh... Oh, so th that that is the end of the chain, I think. Right? I, it looks like in the log I did not get another cipher. Okay, cool, 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 cool. What's next? Objective list. Oops. Oops. Uh. Oh, I I didn't. Okay. I didn't set the thing. I'm a fool. All right, summon. I will summon you again. Yeah, but um, I, gu I guess on the other hand, looking for looking for new monitor recommendations. <laughs> if anyone's got any, any any monitors you like out there. Okay, now I did it. Oh, okay, there's more. How many NPCs I've been collecting? This is like the opposite of a gotcha game. You just get them. Was your job affected by that cloud strike thing today? No, um, some serendipitously, I was on a, I was on a, and I was on a hike with, uh, with interns. We we took the interns out on a like a San Francisco city hike. Um, so we were none of us were at our computers today. <laughs> so I, I actually had no idea until I got home, and then I saw like the, you know, social media posts about it. But um, I, I did see like the news articles of like all of the airports are like down, and it's like just just basically pandemonium, which sounds like, extremely upsetting. And I'm glad I'm not traveling or needing to travel. Trade might affect you Monday. <laughs> well, wow. not my fault. I can't work. Okay. Joaquim. Voodoo also needs new monitors. My knees are darker tan than the rest of my legs. Not a good look. <laughs> I, you know, the, I, is that like a genetic thing? Cause I have some friends where that's true too, but I, I don't have that. My, my, like my knees and elbows are generally, oh, I'm, now I'm trying to like look at my elbow. My, my knees and my elbows are generally the, the same color, but I, I do have friends where that's true. Oh, the knees things happens to you, really? It's like a little bit darker, I guess, but not not by a lot. I don't know. I think I think that just happens though to a lot of people. I feel like it's because your knees are like angled up. Oh, and then it like catches the sun's rays and like tans. Perhaps. Oh, I need to set the objective. I keep forgetting about this. I gotta set the objective. Oh my goodness. So many things to remember. Okay, let's go. I assumed it was because I was doing a lot of sitting in the sun. Ah. Well, make sure you make sure you sunscreen your knees. They might just be knees, but you got to take care of you got to take care of the skin on your knees too. We're up at three. I'm trying to figure out what happened. Oh, I'm sorry, NJ. NJ Gray. NJ Gray. I realized I hadn't said your your username out loud, and I was like, "Wait, am I reading it correctly?" Yeah, and then, yeah, it sucks to have to stay up so long trying to debug like this thing, this like horrible thing, and then find out it wasn't your fault in the first place. And now you're just mad. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. My sister's IT needed to go on a call with everyone. Tell them to go into safe mode. Oops. Have them entered in a license key. They say over the phone to reverse the update. The update happens silently without telling anyone. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm I'm sure it was chaos at a lot of people's jobs today. I do not. I I'm I'm very lucky that I I don't think we were super affected. This guy has sunglasses. Look at him. Oh, wait, turn around. Are you a pirate or are you sunglasses? Oh, he's a pirate. He's cool. Okay. Uh, did I get? Is this the end? Is this the end of the the chain? Ah, wrong menu button. Current. Objective. Blocky. I think that's the end. I don't have any other items, perhaps. No more ciphers, right? Yeah, no more ciphers. Okay, cool. I've collected all my people. Uh, I usually sunscreen my face because my cheeks are already rosy as it is. I wish I had a good reason for why I forget sunscreen now. Yeah, I usually am pretty good about it because this this thing happened to me before where I got sun, sunburn so bad that it hurt to shower. <laughs> so it's happened to me before and I, I was like, I am going to sunscreen from now on. Very good. And then, but it's just been a, a while since I like went out on a hike or like did any kind of outdoorsy thing and I just, I just forgot. Um, exploring the trove. Uh, main job level 99. I am not able to do that. Assist channel. Speak to the a man liaison from the Mog House in Sandoria, Bastok, or Windurst. And list hear an explanation on the assist channel feature. Sounds doable. Okay, I can do that. Apparently the wait time to call IT today for my work was 11 hours. Oh my god. Now you can summon your crew and commence to murdering. Yay! Click on the magic part? Magic part. Oh, should I go back outside? What does the magic part do? Magic. This? Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go talk to the assist person. Wait, are you are you? Oh, I can do the I can do the trick that loading list taught me. Okay, wait. Let me Objective list. I oh, I read these things and I like immediately forget. Aman liaison in front of the Mog House in Sandoria. Okay. Map? Wide scan? Are they named Aman liaison? Are they gonna be called that? Or are they like called something else? Okay, they do not seem to be called Aman liaison. Yeah, it might be. That's okay. So is this the Mog House? The residential area? Or is Mog House like a separate thing? I don't know. Uh, My sister thinks she only didn't get hit by it because auto updates are broken on her PC, but the version of the one of one of the major programs she uses also doesn't work on the latest version, so she's not about to get IT to fix it. Ah, uh, okay, okay, I see. Oh, okay, that is Mog House. Okay, so I can go back to that that magical piece of real estate that I was at before. Okay. Hello, Kai! How's it going? You've come again with another cute Yoshi emote. Thank you. How, how's your night going? We've uh, we've been chatting about the uh, the the crowd the crowd strike outage <laughs> that apparently affected a lot of people today uh and i was i was just saying that i was not affected by it because i was i was out on a hike a, a bunch of people from from work and i took took a bunch of the interns out on a hike <laughs> so we were not looking at our computers oh wait i'm not supposed to go in the mock house i'm supposed to look at somebody near the mock house <laughs> luckily i'm unaffected oh that's good Oh, I have to manually open doors. Fast him. What server is this, by the way? This is Cat Cat's Eye. Cat's Eye X Eye. Um. Yeah, I I mean I I have nothing to compare to, but like, um, they seem quite well organized. Oh, there you are. There you are, Aman liaison. Tell me about channels. This is an explanation of the assist channel feature, which allows new and returning players to seek help from veteran adventures. Oh, okay. So kind of like, maybe like novice network in 14? What is the assist channel? 
special chat channel that allows adventurers to ask questions from mentors. How can I post a message? Press the space bar, bring up the text window at the bottom of the screen, type assist J or assist E to post your message. You can use AJ or AE. Okay. Control Q. I'm never going to do this, so <laughs> I'm, I'm going to not talk to anybody if I can help it because I'm scared. AJ is for posting Japanese, AE for English. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. There are two FFMMOs. Yes, there is Final Fantasy XI. And then, yeah, and then like the big, the big one that's gotten really big in popularity recently is 14. Yes. Oh yeah, Power just said so. <laughs> yeah, so th this is the older one that this came out like 20 years ago. Um, but uh, I'm playing on a private server that some, some folks have set up. Uh, and I'm doing I'm doing my like beginner quests, <laughs> which requires talking to a lot of NPCs and telling me stuff. Okay, where can I access it? Okay, in cities it looks like. Oh, er early cities probably. That is a lot of places. Oops, oops. Um. Oh, you can sort trust into their job selections by by mock house. Oh, okay. Blah, blah, blah. Flag markers assign the mentors earn the highest levels of trust from other adventurers. Higher the number, the more experienced the mentor is. Okay, interesting. You can check your own mastery rank even if you don't serve as a mentor, if you're curious. What's my mastery rank? It's probably like negative five. Where, where can I find mentors? Never knew. Outside mainline, I know tactics exist. Ah, tactics. Final Fantasy Tactics, which I did get confused one time when somebody was asking me about fast Fourier transforms. Somebody, uh, uh, when I was in grad school, somebody was like, so what comes to mind when I say FFT? I'm like, Final Fantasy Tactics? And they're like, wrong answer. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Thumbs up feature. Okay, so this is kind of like the prototype for, well, I, I shouldn't say prototype, but like the precursor to like, like, re um, commendations, I guess, in 14, perhaps? This, this thumbs up and, and stuff. This is interesting. I wonder if Final Fantasy XI mentor status also had the same problems that 14 mentors do, which is, um, like, I feel like a lot of people want the mentor, like, crown. Like, they want that little icon because it's kind of cool looking. But mentors are notoriously not very nice to newbies. <laughs> um, I don't know. I've, I've never actually engaged in the novice network or, like, talked to mentors. But um, I, I wonder if there's maybe a similar dynamic of, like, oh, I want the status symbol, but I don't actually want to be, like, that helpful. Um... To be fair, it'll be 14 years since the original version of 14 came out in September. Has it really been that long? But uh, but it's only been, I think if I remember correctly, only been 10 years since the reboot, right? But that's still a long time, I guess. What was the right answer? Fast, fast Fourier Transform? Which is like not, uh, which is, I, I mean, it's, I well, I wouldn't say it's like a basic computer science thing, but it's like a, it's like a concept that I probably should have known about. But I was like, this is not relevant to my current research, so... Okay, what am I doing? Oh, I'm level 10! Yay! That seems important. Icon not very good in in 11. Oh, okay. <laughs> By the amount of people who still play, you think it's half the age. Yeah, I mean, well, they... It's changed a lot. Like, they really... Like, even when I first started... Like, I, I started playing um, when Heavensward came out, uh, which was the expansion after the reboot. And so it's a version three, I guess. Um, and there was a lot of quality of life stuff that was missing. Like, I, I remember back in the day, I was like complaining to my husband about like, uh, I, I think at the time I had been, um, I had been um, playing Guild Wars 2. And I was like, this is as good as Guild Wars 2, cause blah, 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 blah. Oh, I can't do this one yet. Um, did I have this one? All for one. But yeah, they, they've really added a lot of like, good improvements and stuff to 14. Like, I, I, I do think that the, the dev team is very conscientious of, like, trying to make a good experience, which is which is really great. Uh, speak to one of the following Unity Concord guides. 
Or B lane. G10. Okay. I can find G10. All for one! And one for all. Something, something. My Hero Academia. G10. 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 Okay. Oh, near here. Near this little crystal. Okay. Uh, I'm over here. Oh, can I use my... Can I use my... Can I use the... Where are we going? Can I use this crystal to teleport over there? I remember the 14 beta, beta that was painful. I'm so curious about playing 1.0. Um, I, t I told this on stream last time I played uh, 11 last week. Because uh, originally my idea was I want to... Uh, what does this mean? Oh my gosh. Teleport to... These are all the same thing. Okay, I'm just gonna walk. This is confusing. But my originally my idea was to play a private server... Play on a private server of the original Final Fantasy XIV. Um, but there is none. Like, there, there is, like, a GitHub where you can set it up yourself, but it's got... It's, like, very bare bones. Um, it doesn't have any of the, like, server-side stuff. You can, like, set up a server, and if you really want to, you can, like, figure out how to set up NPCs and, like, quests and things like that. But none of that comes comes with it. There's no snapshot of like the original Final Fantasy um, 1.0, Final Fantasy 14 1.0. Um, and like, so I searched around and people are like, you know, found some Reddit threads where people are like, why isn't there a private server for original Final Fantasy 14? And like all the comments are like, cause it sucked and nobody <laughs> wants to play it anymore. Like it is not like a place that people want to go back to. I was like, okay, that's fair, I guess. Uh, Brahma Born would have been released for 11 years as of this August. Ah, okay. Dang. It, it, wow, it's been a while. Uh, I wonder if they'll do anything special for 14 years after 14. Oh, I hope so. That'd be cute. They, I mean, they, they do, uh, they do a anniversary event every year. Um, oh, I'm talking to, who am I talking to? I've already forgotten the name. Not you. Drashion? Who was I supposed to talk to? I forgot already. Uh, my bird brain memory. Talk to Erbiolane. Erbiolane. Erbiolane? I don't see an Erbiolane. <laughs> I guess I'll. I'll use the wide scan. Yeah, but four, fourteen has a has a pretty um, nice anniversary event every year. Um, I think one year, like the like Yoshi P, like the producer, he was he like showed up as a as an NPC, and then they had like a little room where you could go into, and there was like NPC versions of some of the dev team, and you could talk to them and be like. Like, you know, and they had like little messages from the dev team, like kind of like thanking the players or like, this is how, you know, working on this game has changed my life. And like, this is what I hope for the game in the future. It was very, very cute. Um, you, you can probably find, ooh, here we are, or B lane. Oh, there, by the wall. Hmm? Hmm? According to the map, or B lane is supposed to be like here. Are you? Oh, you're a wheeling. Oh, there you are. Ah! Oh my gosh, what's happening? Okay. Talk to me. Cutscene. Tell me. Why, sweetie, is that all for one you have set there? Don't talk to me. Don't call me sweetie, you weirdo. I love people who are direct and to the point. This can mean only one thing. You have an interest in Unity Concord. I don't know what that means. How do I participate? I'm scared. Is this multiplayer content? Oh, ho, ho. I bet you say that to all the Unity Concord guides. I, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared of this lady. Getting started is very simple. Press its tummy. Oh. Press its tummy and watch it squeal like a man made out of bread dough. Tee hee. What is this dialogue? You press your index finger into the doll's belly button. The doll begins to twitch and shudder. This little device is known as a Concord doll. 
The, the doll has brought us closer together than two people are ever meant to be. Perhaps that's a tad over the top, but the doll is a symbol of your participation in Unity Concord, a system developed by the Adventurer's Manual Aid Network, Aman. Let me explain. Unity Concord brings together people of like mind to share wonderful experiences with each other, both on and off the battlefield. And you are now part of this wondrous organization. You know what would make me elated? If you were to choose a Unity leader. Go on now. <laughs> I literally do not know how, who any of these people are. Okay, I guess I'll pick my favorite name. Puget. I am a invincible. The, okay, so these must be related maybe to like the major cities. Um, I don't know how you randomly chose the perfect whisperer. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know. It's a, her initial dialogue was definitely like a dead giveaway to her uh, style of talking. Aldo, Matt, Mott, Jaco Wakandalo, Naja Salahim, Flaviria. Oh, they're major story characters? Yoran Oran, Sylvie. I like I like Sylvie. They sound cool. Should I be like doing the main story? Am I not? Where where is the main story? I feel like I'm just kind of doing random stuff. Sylvie. Sylvie sounds cool. Hmm. Sylvie Sylvie's Unity crack. That's where you want to stay until I can woo you over to mine. Um. Should you join one Unity? You will not be able to switch to another one until the ring. Okay. So this is not a permanent thing. Okay. Now squeeze your Concord doll, chew, close your eyes, and think pleasant thoughts of your new Unity leader. I... Why are these dolls, like, the... the medium through which... Sylvie, dot dot dot. Jojo's story! It's Jojo's story! Wait, so does this mean you'll be joining my Unity? With you on our team, we'll be truly unstoppable... unstoppable-able. Unstoppable-able. To tell you the truth, I wasn't sure what to do when the Adventures M Mutual Aid Network first invited me. If it weren't for Iki's guidance, I'd be down a creek full of paddles. She said if the Unity could show people everywhere how to communicate with nature and spread the ways of the Geomancer, then it was worth something- it was something worth doing. There's still a lot I don't know as a Geomancer, but I'm gonna triple down and do my best as you well. Let's make this the best Unity we can. Yeah! Go team! Okay, I like her. I, I do not know what kind of person she is, but she seems cool. Did your intro introduction go well? Concord dolls really are fabulously create fabulous creations, what with being able to converse over long distances. Yours can be used to talk with others belonging to the same unity. My heart aches knowing that you value that doll more than you do me. Girl, I met you like five seconds ago. Calm down. <laughs> That's okay. I won't keep you from talking with your friends. Good. It would be toxic otherwise. Please don't. <laughs> If you like them so much, why don't you select the chat settings from Unity Info from the Unity section of the status submenu and let all your feelings out. <laughs> oh, I can ask her if something's bothering you. I can say thanks or, uh, sorry. What's bothering you, Ubio, Ub Urbiole? <laughs> what was that emote? Wouldn't a creek full of paddles be good? That's true. Yeah, you're right. It's the opposite, isn't it? That is usually the thing. No, I'm perfectly fine. Now go have fun with your unity and leave me to wallow in peace. Oh god, and I cl clap to disappear. Okay. I got a Concord doll. I've joined Sylvia's unity. Can I talk to her again? You okay, girl? Bring me to a wanted encounter area. Enhance my equipment. Add an attribute to enhance. I, I want to change unities. Tell me more about this. What do you want? More questions? Okay, let me take out this brack breakingly heavy guide I've been lugging around for days. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Alright, okay, I did that quest. What else we got? How do I do the story? Let me is this the story? Okay. S someone needs to Okay, wait, no, I can probably There should be more characters acknowledging <laughs> game. Yeah, that was pretty that was a funny bit. Okay, I stopped doing this because I, I couldn't remember which NPC assigned me this this mission. I'm gonna just Google it. Smash the Orcish Scouts. Uh, return to Sandoria and trade the Orcish Axe to the Sandorian Gate Guard. Uh, just any Sandorian Gate Guard? 
I guess. Okay, I will try. Are you? Are you? I don't. I. Oh man, I don't remember <laughs> which gate guard. Okay, let's go look for a gate guard. Uh, go to the map. Which story? I. I. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know which story. I clicked on missions. Nations. Oh, Sandoria story, I guess. So I, I guess just tied to this area. Can you do the stories in any order? <clears throat> Let me grab a drink. Yum yum. Delicious tea. Old tea. I should pick up this crystal. Confession time, I've never played an MMO. That is not a confession. That That is something to be proud of. <laughs> Do not worry. What's that? What's the glowing orb? <gasps> it's the weaving... Oh no, it's the leather working guild. This is the same icon they use in 14. Ooh, the history. Which gate guard did I talk to? I got a fantasy star online game controller emote. Wait, that's so cool though. I didn't I didn't know that the I didn't know that GameCube controller emote or game con, GameCube controller existed until five seconds ago and now I want one. <laughs> I wanna have one. Some of the prereqs required for some of, some prereqs required for some of the storylines. Ah, okay. Is there like a recommended order in which to do the storylines? I mean, I guess probably just in temporal order, huh? Oh, I'm going to a manor. That's not where I want to go. White skin. Any gate guards on this list? Seems like they only... They only list, like, named NPCs. Okay. I went to Westgate. There's nobody at Westgate. Maybe I need to go into the south? The south part of the city? It's literally a GameCube controller with a keyboard on the wall. Yeah! That's so cool! There are people who play competitive Smash on it? <laughs> it's just like a flex? <laughs> or was it like actually better somehow? Um, oh gosh, where am I going? Wait, I'm lost. This way? Are there gate guards here? What's in this hole? 100% of flex, okay. <gasps> oh, I'm up here now. That's cool. Hey, Jakya. Nation rank missions is a good start. Base game story, essentially. Oh, okay, so I'm on the right track. I just need to find the freaking NPC I'm supposed to go talk to. I mean, maybe I should have just been doing that instead of tutorial stuff. Well, it was, I, it was good to get the trusts, I guess. I can survive on my own. Imagine playing a game holding a full-size keyboard. Uh, I'm lost. Oh, I'm not lost. I'm go this way. Oh, now I want one. I have always wanted to play Fantasy Star Online. Um, but I, I have no idea if it's even good. But I, for some reason, when I was like... In high school, I, I got it in my head that it would be like the best MMO ever to play. Where am I? <laughs> I went in the weird direction. I am in a not the correct place. Um, I got in my head that like fi fa Fantasy Star Online would be awesome. Oh, you know what it was? It's because we had, we had just gotten a Dreamcast and I really wanted to try playing Fantasy Star Online on our Dreamcast and like figure out how to do that. But I never, I never did. Cause you needed the like, the Ethernet um, adapter and such. They, I think they have RK or TK after the name by the exits to outside. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, okay. Well, let me let me try this again. RK or TK. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So maybe I can talk to this guy. Hello. Would you like an orcish axe? Okay. Um. Would you cast Signet on me? 
Okay. I got some kind of buff. He didn't want my axe. Do I need to... Maybe across from him? Okay. <laughs> you won't help me. I'm going to talk to your friend over here. Do you want my axe? He doesn't want to talk to me. He says nothing. Eh? Malid Charter Sub. Okay. Not him. I'll never forget when McDonald's had GameCube demos. What? Tell me more. Sorry, further over. And Drashian? Oh, thank you. <laughs> this seems like much Googling is needed to play this game. Though I, I suppose at some point maybe you get used to everything. Hello, hesitant dragon. Gonna warn you, Final Fantasy XI is very much a wiki game source. I've been playing for over 20 years. Oh, okay, you, you, oh. <laughs> I said my thing after you sent your message. I'm sorry, you're saying the exact same. Okay, I'm glad my intuition for this is correct. Thank you for the warning. It, it, it's good to have those expectations set. Okay, Androshan says, bring me one of those axes and your mission will be success. Okay, finish your current mission first and then come back for another. What, I, I bought, I, I thought I had an axe. Did I not pick up an axe? Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna go. <laughs> uh, but welcome, Hesitant Dragon. I, I hope you enjoy me watching me fumble around. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of just having fun, like, exploring the world, I think. I, I like, I'm, I am fascinated. I got, okay, I got some, I got some guys. Let me summon a tank, just for funsies. Oh, trade it to him! Okay. Right. I, I'm spoiled my modern games while they will just take the thing from my inventory. McDonald's had GameCube setups with demos of certain games, multiple each. Oh, I vaguely remember this. Vaguely, vaguely remember this. Like, it used to be in, like, the play places area, right? Like, there would be, like, the big, like, play structure, but then also... Also, like, game station. Oh, do I not have one? I guess I never picked one up. Yeah, I don't have one. Do I have to... I I don't have to, like, pick up loot from the ground, right? This isn't Ragnarok Online, right? Is it, like, a prop... Is there a drop probability? Where I have to grind until I... Until I get an axe? Falls into inventory. Okay. Huh, I don't know what happened. <laughs> the controllers were disgusting. Oh, I'm sure they were. Okay, hello, new friend. Will you protect me? I don't know how this works. Okay, let's go. Let's go find some orcs. Hello, orcs. Oh my gosh, I I was gonna. <laughs> What should I do? Should I keep playing Final Fantasy XI? I, I honestly was like, oh, this will just be like a one and, you know, a one off, like, silly, like, hee hee haha, let's go visit, revisit, you know, 20 years ago, games from 20 years ago. But I'm like kind of into it now. What should I do? I, I meant to, I meant this Final Fantasy XI to be a one off stream, and then here I am playing it again, and like, now I'm like, I kind of want to play it again next week. What do I do? Okay. Attack! Get him! Attack! Attack! Oh, whoa! Why are you so cool? Sentinel. <gasps> Sentinel is a Final Fantasy XIV uh, ability! Played until you're bored? Okay. You can summon three at the start, I think. But that just seems unfair. Is this not the correct monster. Did I get anything? It should say in the log, right? If I got stuff. Uh... Hmm. I guess I'll kill another one? See what happens? Hello, you're next. Die. Yeah, left log will say. Okay. You think it's interesting? Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess, yeah, maybe maybe just keep going until until it gets too repetitive, perhaps? It, it does feel a little bit like going back in time. And and it's 
It's cool that people who are big into Final Fantasy XI are somehow coming to my stream <laughs> and being like, ah, let me give you my wisdom, my child. I'm so glad that the orc is hitting this guy and not me. Okay. I got a beast and seal. Okay, I guess I have to maybe grind these orcs for a while and see if they drop a... drop a... an axe. It's slow pace enough most of the time to talk to chat. Yeah, that's true. Then I have to come up with things to say. Oh, is something chasing me? No. Okay. Uh. Wild rabbit, wild rabbit, wild rabbit. So many wild rabbits, dingbats, orcish fodder. Okay, there's more over to the northwest. Trust parties change the game. You can basically solo most of the game now. That's what I like to hear. I am so scared of people. <laughs> Not because they think they're gonna, well, there, there's a small fear of them being mean to me, but I'm mostly scared of disappointing others. Whoa, what are these? I'm scared. Scarab Beetle seems like easy prey. Okay, let's get this guy. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared of being... I'm scared of being multi-attacked by multiple things. Oh no, it's happening! Protect me! Millenarial, protect me! Protect me! Individual mobs trackable on the map? Yeah, apparently. Axe? No axe. Am I not? Am I not? Am I not killing the right thing? I thought it said orcish. Somebody last time said that orcish fodder was the correct thing, even though it says something else. It says orcish scout here. I'm doing it right. Okay. Thank you for confirming. It's always hard to tell sometimes with, with older games. <laughs> can I, can I, can I fight this thing yet? Easy prey. Oh yeah, time for revenge. It probably would help if I summoned more guys. Um, I'm gonna summon Millie Al Al Aliopo. Oh, I can't use trust magic now. Okay. The tracking mob thing, white scan used to be ranger only. <gasps> really? And everyone was like, please, we need it for our sanity. That makes a lot of sense. Got a fire crystal. Guess I can. Let's summon Millie. And let's summon Tenzin, because I recognize those names from Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> Ranger beastness. Gosh dang. Oh my gosh, this party this party dialogue is so huge. Where do I put you? Over here? Over here? Uh move these things over. Okay. Alright. Come my my warriors. Protect me. Where's the orcish fodder? Orcish fodder. Where are you? No one can harm me now. I will never go back to the void. For all the works. Does none dare face me now that I have friends? None dare face me. But Unbeknownst to you, I have technology on my side. Orcish fodder here. Okay, down or south. Oh, I guess maybe they respawned back in that original spot. Well, we grinding. We grinding now. Uh. Uh. Um. Where is it? Come out, come out to wherever you are. 
Where the heck? Is this like, is this part of the game? Like is, is some of the game just like trying to find things? <laughs> Orcish fodder. Okay, keep going. Wait. I shall find you. you. Can use HXUI to adjust this party for every other time. Oh! Oh, wait, I found one. Attack! Get them! Get them! Go! Attack! Attack my friends! Yes! Do my bidding! Yes! Yes! Hey, 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 hey. Where's the axe? How come they don't give me axe? Hello? Can I kill this other orc for the same quest? Oh, oh, they look scary. Wait, they look scary. Let me check. Easy prey. Oh, okay. They're not scary. Go get them. Go get them. Go get them, my friends. Go get them. Attack. A solar MMO gamer's dream. Yeah, exactly. Get them. Ah, don't hurt me. In the heyday, would this be populated with other players to interact with? Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. I got a fire crystal. Well, does nobody have an axe to leave behind when they die? Northwest, that outpost zone is an orc outpost with several outside. Oh, okay, thank you. Northwest, you say. Northwest. Ah, okay, this, this outpost zone, okay. I shall, I shall go. The interaction would be competing for mobs to kill. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that does sound like Ragnarok. Yeah, in, in Final Fantasy XIV, the mobs spawn pretty quickly. Like, there isn't really people- there aren't really people, like, fighting over things. I, I guess a little bit with, um, like, the bigger bosses, like, the map bosses. That- that respawn on, like, a timer. But yeah, thankfully- thankfully there's no shortage of, like, things to kill. If this is a classic MMO, you have to kill about 300 of these. <laughs> One axe! We're gonna be here for a while. That's fine. I love hanging out with y'all. Oh! Do grapplers have axes? I don't think so. You get to live another day. Carrion worm. Carrion worm. You can take your worm on the airplane, because it's a carrion worm. What's over there? There's like a building of some kind. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't want to go. Ah! Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there, don't worry. We can take a bathroom break once we get there. Okay. Oh, look at these pleasant flags. Do you think they're welcoming us? What nice decorations they've put up. Oh. Orcish fodder. <gasps> look at all these guys we can kill. Okay, let me... I kind of want to handle them one at a time so I don't get... I don't get ganged up on. Hey, sir! Eh. Ah! <laughs> okay, I like my strategy if I go up and stab the one so that I just run behind my... Run behind my much stronger and cooler friends. I don't want to be mean, but did the MMO designers despise people's time? Well, uh, I think that is kind of true... Like... With game design in general, I think. Well, even now, like... Um, you, you want people to, like, play it a lot, you know? Because those are numbers you give back to, like, you know, investors and stuff, I'm sure. Like, oh, like, these people are playing for, you know, hours and hours and hours. And, like, look how lucrative this game is, right? Like, I, I think it's a good, it's a good metric to have, but 
um, unfortunately, not. It's a good metric to have financially, I think, but maybe not in terms of like actual practice. But like, the, I think the trick is maybe you gotta you gotta find like the you gotta try to squeeze out as much time you can from people without them actually quitting. Look at our dictionary. Yeah, I mean, like, seriously. I don't know. I, I think that's kind of how... Oh my god, there's so many orcs. Help! Not all of you at once, please. One at a time. One at a time, please. Please, please sign up for death one at a time. Ah, I leveled up. Does nobody have an axe? Please. Why? Why do you not have an axe? Did I miss it in the log? <laughs> the odd thing is, this was way back before they figured out how to monetize that time spent in the game. Mmm. Reminds me of Dragon Guard, the worst best game <laughs> I've ever played. I do. Dragon Guard is related to the near story line, right? Am I. Am I remembering that wrong? But I feel like I have to play it at some point just to kind of fill in the gaps with the story. I guess there's maybe a strong correlation between time spent in game and the purchase of the next expansion since MMOs were all about expansions back then. Mm. Yeah, probably. I, I don't I mean I I mean I'm just, you know, speculating. It's not like I'm a game designer and stuff. I'm sure it's a lot more complicated than I'm like making it out to be. But I don't know. You you do see this a little bit with gotcha games where you know, they, they want you, they definitely want you addicted to the game. And it, it, it there is a very clear monetization strategy of like, oh, the more you play the game, like the more you're incentivized to like pull for stuff and spend spend money on the gotcha. Who haven't gotten an axe? Oh man, fighting, fighting monsters is so easy. You got a band of really strong friends on your side. Okay. Um, any more fodders? Looking for f uh oh, we got, we got wait who's who's attacking? Oh you you you're gonna be sorry you messed with me and my friends. Ah! Go get him! See that guy? It's him! He beat me up. Yeah, that's what I thought. Gotchas are the violent optimization of that principle, basically. Yeah, something like that. I don't know. I mean, I'm just kind of... I'm speculating. I, 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 I'm I, just like... This is me as a player. I've, I've never made a game. <laughs> me as a player speculating. Dragon Guard spawned the near universe and is the one game I'd welcome a remake. Ooh. Well, I hope so. Because I, I would definitely play a remake. Because I, I know it's an older game, right? So... Be nice to get a little a refreshed version of it, maybe with some new story stuff added. Me as an armchair game designer speculating. <laughs> yeah, that's basically me. Ah! I'm the armchair game designer. Game designers hate her. I want an axe. All I want for my birthday is an axe. It's not my birthday. But my my trust party doesn't know that. We're we're just gonna have to murder this whole colony of orcs just to get a freaking axe. Have we ever thought about asking politely? Ugh. Ah! Get him! Get him! Where's the axe? Is it really? Is it really just random? I just have to wait for an axe to drop. I'm sure game design speculation is welcome. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's not a problem as long as you're honest about like kind of your experience. Wait, that's that's probably true for life in general. Just uh, don't don't oversell yourself when unnecessarily. I think we killed all the orc fodders. Is this their house? They don't have any roofs. 
Damn, you live like this? Orcs? Why am I stuck? Eh? Why am I stuck? Help. <laughs> uh, help! Excuse me? Tenzin? Um... There's one camp in EverQuest I had to do for 30 hours? <gasps> Before I got the item I needed? Oh my god. <laughs> Melee enjoyer. Trust party will only attack if you hit the enemy with audio attack. Ah. Episode 2, Return to the Void. Oh god. What's wrong with me? Help. <laughs> Can I jump in this game? I cannot. Um. Oh. Okay, that was scary. I got grabbed by the, like, environmental polygons. Oh, look, a hole. What's in here? Bound and you can jump. You can slash jump. Ah, okay, okay. Thank, thank goodness. The environment let me go. Did I not be here? Here, I'm scared. Gelsba, Gelsba outpost. Hello. Any orcs in here? Oh my god, my guys are gone. Let me just take a peek. Just a little peek. The mesmerizer mage org use bind on you. Oh. I see. I gotta figure out. There's these icons. Is this where my? Oh, you can't see my mouse. In the, in that the top left, there's those like little icons. Like one looks like a gusher, and the other one looks like a, I don't know, upside down, ocean, like tier of the ocean. Let me take a little peek. Any monsters here? Are are those my like buffs slash debuffs? I wish I could mouse over them to see what that is. Protect and signet. Ah. You're using controller. Yes, I am. But I, I mean, my, my mouse and keyboard are like right in front of me, so I can switch to that easily, too, if necessary. By the way, hello, Proton Broton. Good to see ya. Uh, I was just telling chat that I, I am surprisingly, I have been... Um, oh, there are, there are guys here. Okay, cool. Time to summon my minions. Hold on, get ready for your destruction. Um, I was just telling chat that I was like surprisingly I've been I've been captured by the appeal of Final Fantasy 11 <laughs> And now I'm like maybe this shouldn't be a, be one-off streams. Maybe I should actually just Play for a little while and have fun Why why triangle twice to select them? Okay triangle twice Triangle twice triangle opens the menu for me for some reason um, no. No. Square, maybe? <gasps> oh, okay, it's square for some reason. Ah, defense is enhanced. You're recognized as an official participant in your... Ah, okay, cool. I don't know, I talked to some person, they cast Signet on me, and I don't know why. Where'd my... Where'd my Tenzin go? Tenzin! Tenzin, come here. Um... The environment is the worst enemy in the game. Hit F twice to see those. Ah, okay. Possible to play this game with just keyboard. I, I, I'm, I'm in general a controller gamer, so I, I feel safer with controller. Uh, so I don't know, but I'm, I'm sure both is fine. I'm not, I'm not used to like WASD though. I get confused. Maybe square by default. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, it, the controller setup process was a little, ah, was a little, um, a little weird, but I figured it out. Attack! Attack! I want an axe! I will not kill everybody in this place if you just give me an axe. Whoa, what's that? Are you a bad guy? What is that? Ig, what does that say? Ig Igni something launcher? If I hide behind the tree, will it see me? One launcher? Is that a monster? That looks scary. Or some games mouse and keyboard does a mouse. Yeah, that's true. If if I if I can avoid it, I, I always choose keyboard. Or sorry, I always choose controller. Oh no, I'm just used to it. 
Um, but it's always good when a game has. Where are your axe wielding friends? Tell me. You can play with Waz, but numpad is the way to go. Whoa, numpad. That's a pro strat right there. I like the battle music. A lot of people play 14 with controller. I I think so. It's it's very well supported. Um, and they they have a pretty fancy like controller system. Um, I don't know how to explain it in words. It's called the crossbar. And I'm not sure if it shows up in other controller oriented games, but it, it 14 was the first place that I had encountered this game. It's a little, I guess it's a little bit like the m m maker of things where, um, at least the way my controller is set up, I, I can click a trigger, one of the left or right trigger to like open, you know, this, this map of buttons. And then if I press like a, a, uh, button combination, then I can I can execute a specific ability that I have assigned to that button combination. Um, it's a little hard to explain. I don't know, but I, I so I'm not sure if 14 like invented it or like if it's a thing in other games. But it does it does make playing controller kind of like very doable, even though. Uh, you know, even though there's like five billion abilities that you can you can do per per class. Um, oh my gosh! Oh, that that guy has such good eyesight. Oh, please! <laughs> Get him! Get him! They look like Ninja Turtles if you look at them up close. Ow! I leveled up! I'm level twelve. Controller makers in fourteen are really nice. Yeah. The idea of playing an MMO with a controller makes the veins in my eyes twist. Oh man, I, I can't imagine any other way now. I'm honestly so used to it. Orcish stone launcher. That thing looks so scary. I don't know if your mod will interfere, but there are options you need to set in config in the triangle menu, like inventory auto sort and the buff timers. Oh, I, I set the auto sort. Um, somebody told me about the auto sort. What's a buff timer? Uh... See, just just taking a moment in my orcish conquest by buff timers. Gameplay maybe? Mm, no, not here. Hmm. <laughs> chat filters, uh, Windows log, misc. Probably a misc. Oh, my knees hurt. I just moved my knee. I just moved my legs around. Oh, my knees. Oh, I'm so old. <laughs> What was I looking for? <laughs> uh, buff timers. Um, I don't know. Timer display? Was it this? Display status icon timers. Oh my gosh! Why isn't that a default option? That's bonkers. Uh, it's cool they decided to make it controller accessible. Yeah! Um, I think... If I remember correctly, this game was originally it was like PS2 first, like it was like it was supposed to be played on PS2. You can just you can just clip through the fence. That's not fair. Get stabbed. Get stabbed. He's too first. Yes. Does an add-on to make 11 speakers like 14s? Really? I'm kind of scared. What? What? Like, I feel like I feel like that's going too far into like. I don't understand how. I like. I'm gonna. I'm gonna lose sight of how Final Fantasy XI works. Why is this tree sparkly? Why sparkle tree? Ugh. What is this? Logging point. Oh, I don't have a hatchet. I killed everybody in this village, and I still don't have a hatchet for my quest. <laughs> Let's kill everybody. Is the pain from sunburn or old? The the knees is from going on that hike, like the hike itself. Oh, I'm scared to approach. They're all gonna attack me at once. The the, the knees pain is from going up and down hills because San Francisco. Okay, okay, okay. I poked him. You go. 
You all go. Get him. Oh no, not that one. Not that one. Get this one. Help. Help me. Get him. You guys get him. Yeah, and then I and then I have pain from my, on my arms from sunburn. Come on! Give me your hat. Give me your hatchet! Please! Ow! Ow! Poke! Poke! I gotta poke this guy. E e e e. In 12 war with party, you're fine here unless you go much deeper in. Okay. They won't give up the goods. They won't give up the goods! They refuse to give in to my unreasonable request of if I kill you, give me your axe. I can see the axe! It's right here! I want it! Sunburn pain is the worst, yeah. I, I'm, it's probably, it feels more okay now than it will tomorrow. Like, I'm sure tomorrow it will feel worse. <laughs> Any more orc fodders? It's a feeling like if you have, get a tattoo. I've never gotten a tattoo. I, I do hear it hurts quite a bit. Do you have to wear like a like a piece of plastic on your on your skin for a while to like protect it while it's healing or something? You have to like wear some kind of covering. I think my parents would freak out if I showed up at home and I was like, I got a tattoo. That's like, you know, even if it was like a tiny like I don't know, like a musical note. <laughs> I've seen that on Instagram, like people getting like a musical note on their like neck or their foot or something. Ah! Why is this guy attacking me? Just because I killed everybody else in the village. Oh, I'm bind. Oh, I see. I see. I'm stuck again. Ah, and I see the debuff up in the corner now. Ah, I see. Okay. Sorry for the backseat, but don't move while fighting. The game is not that advanced. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no, I think somebody mentioned that last time. I don't know. It's just is it is it like bad if I move while fighting, or is it like just unnecessary? Like if it doesn't make any difference, I like um, I want to role play being protected by my big buff friends. Nobody has an axe. One time I sunburned the tops of my feet really bad. Oh no! Wait, that would suck though, because wouldn't it rub, like, when you put your shoes and socks on? And what are you supposed to do, just like, not walk around outside? They give you basically a piece of sticky plastic wrap that protects it from. And you're like, not supposed to shower, right? Or something? I guess it's similar to getting, like, surgery. I've seen some really cool Adventure Time tattoos. I'm tempted. Mm. I've seen some very, very cute, like, color... Like... 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 Uh, I don't know how to describe them. Like, kawaii style, like, pink pastel tattoos. Um, there's like a couple of artists on Instagram, like tattoo artists on Instagram that like work in that kind of style that are, they do like really, really cute, like, like stars and sprinkles and like, like, uh, like, you know, fluffy dragons, like fluffy chibi dragons. And I'm like, oh man, if I ever do get a tattoo, it'd be like that. Like I want that. And it's like rainbow colored. That makes me really tempted, but I, I don't know if I can commit, you know, it's like, I feel like my, if my tastes change, I'll be like, dang, I'm stuck with this very cute pastel tattoo, but I no longer want it on my body, you know? Ah, oh, he's gonna kill me. I'm not supposed to shower? Didn't know that. Yeah, I don't know. Like, or maybe just, or I guess it depends on where you, where you get the tattoo. I, I have a, uh, a friend who got a, like a really big tattoo on her like back. Um, and she, she, like, wasn't supposed to shower for a while. 
The plastic wrap means you can shower. Oh, okay. I mean, oh, okay, maybe maybe she had a tattoo that was like too big for the plastic wrap. There's positional mechanics later on. Thief sneak attack, paladin's cover, etc. That you feel. Ooh. Okay. The role the role playing will will pay off. The spectacle the spectacled the speckled. Wait, why can't they say that word? Bes B spectacled. There is no B. B spectacled the bats. Are the orcs all asleep? Where are you orcs? It's all bats, no orcs. You have to wait for daytime. No orc fodder. I guess I'll go back out and kill the orc fodder out there. I love to talk about tattoos, I'll never get. <laughs> I'm the exact same with tattoos. If something that big is hard to cover well enough to avoid getting it wet. Yeah, okay, I see. Maybe it was just the size. Small ones you can cover and shower just fine. Mm. As a disclaimer, I have only one tattoo. Just have some friends who get them often. I see. Yeah, I have uh, I, I've actually designed a couple of tattoos for um, one of my friends. Um, she, she's someone I've known for a really long time. Uh, and she, she's been like, she was like a big fan of my art since we were like in fourth grade. <laughs> so we go way, way back. Um, like, I don't, I don't think I would accept a commission to design a tattoo for somebody unless I knew them well, like, like this friend. But um, yeah, she's she's had me draw like um, like pets that have passed away, and she's gotten tattoos of my drawings on her, which is like kind of bonkers to think about too hard. But uh, but she she obviously really likes her artwork, and like I and I know she does, so I'm like not afraid to be okay with designing her tattoo. Where are my guys? Oh, I zoned out. Oh no, my guys are gone. <laughs> I forgot. I, I can take them. Don't forget your weapon skills and your job ability. Oh yeah, I got I got this thing. I forgot. Do I have any more weapon skills? I probably learned some since I've been leveling. Uh, let me summon my guys before I die. Yeah. Come back. Can I make this a macro? I probably should, huh? Like summoning my my party. Uh, after the first one, I've decided I'm only going to get more if they're drawn by people I know. Oh, okay. Yeah, like, I, I'm kind of uncomfortable with the idea of, like, they're putting their art on my body. And, like, also, what if they don't like it later? Then I'll be really, I mean, both of us will be upset. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I, I think it has to be, like, I 100% I trust this person that they will not regret this. I can. Okay. Wait, let me let me look. Okay, so I think somebody mentioned earlier. I'm gonna do this right now. I hope this is not like boring to watch. Uh maker, 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 maker. Micro. Edit micro. Confirm. Okay. So like I can do like trust party. Cool. Tr trust party and then is it slash is it like slash trust their name or something Blaine Norell is it like this I should look this up I should just I, I guess this is what you guys mean by it's a wiki game <laughs> uh trust baker command Final Fantasy 11 uh let me see slash slash Oh, man. Oh, there's like fancy macros on Reddit that I do not fully understand. Trust name me. Oh, okay. I ca oh, I cast it on myself. That's interesting. Trust me. -lee. Does do I do a space or no? In in the party list, Aaliyah, Melia Leopold is one word. So I guess I'll do it like that. Okay, I can give that a spin next time I... Next time I... Okay, next time I zone. Okay, did I... How do I save this? Enter. Okay, I think that has worked. Okay, cool. Excellent. 
Oh wait, I should check my, my skills. Do I have any new skills that I learned from leveling up? Uh, abilities. Job abilities? Oh, I have provoke now. Turn all melee attacks into critical hits. That's a buff, I think. Fast blade. Ranged attack. I have no ranged attack. Mount. No mounts available. No pet commands. I don't want a pet. Okay. Um. Okay, so I can do like this. Okay, cool. M A trust name. Me wait six. Ooh. I actually don't know. I don't use makers. I old school fast menu it all myself. Whoa. <laughs> I mean that's impressive in a different way. You got the you got the muscle memory down, huh? Okay, trust party. Okay, let me try this again. M A. Uh. Can't move the cursor. The M A. Elaine Arell. Me. Wait, say. Oh, okay. Okay. This is this is also similar to Final Fantasy Seven or Seven. Final Fantasy Fourteen. Why did I say Seven? It's getting late. <laughs> I should probably end the stream soon. I'm so tired from being outdoors because I am a weakling. M A. Like this. I mean, red mage too. Dang. This red mage in this game. I guess it's been around for a while. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Okay, like this. Wait, so if I do this now, can I try, can I test it? Oops. The alter ego has already been called forth. Command error occurred. Oh, so Melia Leopold maybe needs a, uh, needs a oops, space. Man, this this UI is bonkers, though. It is. It is a thing to get used to. Okay. Needs a space. Okay. Gonna sleep. Good luck. Thank you. Bye, Wizmander. Have a good uh, have a good night and have a good rest of your weekend. You can switch jobs freely at Modcast. Ah. First six jobs are the same as Final Fantasy One. Orcish fodder. Orcish fodder. Get ready to die. I poke you. I poke you first. Bam! Right in the butt. Get him! Get him! Protect. Po protectra. Protectra. Wow. You still haven't gotten an axe. Ah! Attack! Stab the thigh! Stab the thigh! Okay. okay. This feels like a necessary violence. <laughs> Just for a hatchet. Why why will why will they not give me the hatchet? Why is my parrying skill rising? Is it just from being in battle? Like, I still don't have the item, right? I keep checking because... Dang, okay. Is this missing a V in the title? Wait, what is? Oh, hey, Jesse. This is missing a V. <laughs> I know, right? Dawn Trail looks different, right? <laughs> You're like, what is this? We're playing some Final Fantasy XI, baby. It's a, it's pretty fun, actually. I, I don't know. I was just, I was just telling folks, like, I think I'm, I'm still a little bamboozled by the UI. Um, I think I'll get used to it though. Well, I don't know. It's like it's nostalgic, even though I've never played it. But it's nostalgic in the like old school MMO kind of way. Hello, Deco Pond, fellow newbie. Goodbye, Deco Pond. I 
I want, I want my drop. Give me my drop. I won't have to murder you all. Final Fantasy XI. Vi, Vi escaped from the void. Have you, um, uh, Jesse? I think last time you were here, you mentioned you were still working through the Dawn Trail story. Did you have you managed to catch up with the with the main story quest yet? Uh, okay, we gotta kill these guys. Get, come back, come back, coward. Oh, you have you have caught up. I want to know your thoughts about the. Oh, why are we? Why are you guys over there? I'm being attacked over here. Help me. You. My dream is to not raise a finger <laughs> while I'm. I don't want my character to raise a finger. Let everybody else do the work. That's the dream. Where did my I want an axe? Am I supposed to like do something? Pick it up, maybe? Finished MSQ not doing raid, not motivated. Oh, that's fair. Um Yeah, I haven't checked out the raid at all. I, I just saw a bunch of Reddit posts where people were like, oh, this is really good content. And I was like, huh, that's unusual. <laughs> Usually people are like, eh, it's too boring or eh, it's too I don't know, but like um, so I might check it out just to just this check out just like the regular fights just to just for the story. Um, it's a mouse bat. I don't want to check the bat. That's so cute. This seems pretty unlucky. I yeah, I guess so. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to get one of these like chests. I want to open this. No, I want to open it. How do I open this? Treasure casket. A pot of silent oil. Sure. Lubricant cuts down 99.99% .99 of all friction. When applied, it can nearly erase all noise emitted from a person or an object. Sure. What's that for? Oh, like if I want to sneak past mobs, maybe, is what that's for? <laughs> um, I love how a lot of Final Fantasy XI things got copied into 14. Yeah, we were talking about that. Um, I, I was just walking around the town earlier and um, noticing that all of the like crafting guild buildings, they all have the same symbols as the, the crafting job icons in 14. I was like, oh, this is where it's from. I'm going to go back to Orc Town, see if I can. I want to get my hatchet. I want to end the stream after getting my hatchet so I can finally finish my very first main story quest. <laughs> But I, they're not giving it to me. They refuse. I guess worst case I could grind off off stream, but also ten, Tenzin, sheath your sword. We're certain this is how to get the hatchet. Yeah, I, uh, uh, Final Fantasy XI player earlier was confirming that it is the correct thing. I'm fairly sure. Let me just double check. I, I I had the the wiki page open for this quest earlier. Yeah, it's a, the wiki page says defeat orcish fodder to obtain an orcish axe. So I should be getting an item that says orcish axe. Is there no like there's no like drop rate table or anything, right? Dropped from. Yeah, it's just a drop. I guess I have to be lucky. <laughs> Fodders. Yeah, okay, that's correct. And j just unlucky seems like, oh, ooh, I can trust, try my trust party. Macro. Yeah. For example, I mean, Je Jesse, you might recognize um, Tenzin, right? Like, I, I think the Tenzin in 14 is referencing this NPC that I have in my party. Um, we've got, I have an NPC in my party named Melia Leopo, which is also a reference. That's kind of fun. Oonga boonga. <laughs> All right. I summoned my people, my guardians. Let's go. 
kill some things. Yeah! Get poked! Get poked! Get poked! Aliyah is a common Makote last name. Ah, okay. I- oh, I thought it was- I thought it was... Um... Specifically related to those, like, two- there's, like, two NPCs? Two, two or three NPCs that do the, like, uh... The Wondrous Tales and, like, the... the, the I forget what where the other one's from. Um, but, but yeah, I got maybe more NPCs have the name. I'm actually not sure. You're probably right. I'm gonna poke this guy in the butt when he's not looking! Get him! Ah! Estimate a 5% drop in outpost, 5% drop outside of outpost? Oh, so I shouldn't be in here. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. But they spawn so slowly! Okay, I'm gonna- I'll go back outside. All right, fine. I'll go back outside. Oh, I'm lost. Where am I? <laughs> this way. This way. Let's go outside of the outpost. Thank, thank you. How did you find that out, by the way? Is that is that on the wiki? The drop rate information? Or is there, like, some other website? <laughs> Same ones. Okay, I see. Ah, oh, cool. Oh, I guess I guess I can change my my surprise to oh, like the naming conventions have kind of come over as well. Oh yeah, I saw like a Rogadin looking character in town that also had kind of Final Fantasy fourteen Rogadin style name, like like you know hot boulder or whatever they whatever names they have. I can't I can't remember. The last name is from here, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like the na like the naming conventions and inspiration of kind of. I forgot I haven't summoned my guys. I'm so sad that they disappear every time I change zone. Cory Boulder, that's right. Cory Boulder. The Galka have the tribal names. Wait, wait uh, who are the Galka again? I, I do not quite have the. The, the race names down. One of the popular repositories for private service has a default rates data. Ah, uh, okay. That that makes sense. <gasps> that guy's a cool bear! Or wolf or something? You're so cool, man. Oops, I, I moved while... <laughs> I moved while I was casting the summoning spell. Ro is Gawka. Ah, okay. Uh, I see, I see. Are you an orcish fodder? I'm sorry, you must die. I keep accidentally selecting myself. Here we go. Go! Get him! Come on! Come on, give me that hatchet! <gasps> I did it! Oh, all I had to do was ask nicely! Let's go home. Wrap it up, boys and girls, we're going home! Yeah! And now I gotta go to that guy that I forgot his name already! I can't remember any of the NPC's names. Yeah! I was... <laughs> how long does that take? Like, 30 minutes? <laughs> That's an MMO for ya! How long am I gonna be in this honeymoon of, like... This honeymoon phase of like, oh man, grinding for items, so nostalgic. And like two streams from now, I'll be like, oh my god, why am I playing this? The music's the music good still. We got the axe! Yes, we did get the axe, Voodoo! Hello, Snesso! Fun seeing 14 players discover the 11 for the first time, but usually people run away very quickly. I gotta say, I, I thought this was gonna be a... I thought this was gonna be like a one-off stream. I also streamed it last week to, to give it a try, but that was mostly me. Oh, I, I'm getting lost. Where am I going? And that, that was mostly me just kind of like... You know, trying, trying stuff out. 
um, and, and like getting used to the UI and stuff, which is very different. But uh, yeah, but I'm kind of, I don't know, I'm curious. I, I, I'm curious to explore and I, I really haven't gotten into any of the like base, like the story quests. So I don't know, I want to meet, I want to meet some of the characters. Like I, I really want to do more like world exploring. I'm interested. Why is there a big glowing hole in the ground? Should I touch it? Are you a trap? What is this? Planar rift? I don't want to go there. I'm in the wrong. I'm in the wrong place. Why am I in a rock? Ah, leave me alone. It is a void. <laughs> no special quest item tags. Everything is some random item in some weird location you'll never remember, hence wiki game. <laughs> That's all right. I'm, uh, I, I, I guess I do play wiki games in the sense that I, I am very wiki heavy when I play like my farming game sins. So like with every Harvest Moon game I've ever played, I have like 10 tabs open. Um, Stardew Valley, I, I like made a spreadsheet. Uh, I don't. I don't usually do that, that sort of thing with uh, RPGs, but um, never too late to start. Let's go. Okay. But I, I'm kind of surprised there isn't maybe a, an add-on for like being able to view quests. Like, kind of in the same way that 14 has those, like, quest markers that you can easily navigate to. Who am I talking to? You! Got your stupid axe! It took a really long time! Oh, I have to trade it to him. I- I understand the game now. Select myself. Trade. To this. Man. Here's a- here's your freaking orcish axe. There you go. He looks stunned. Oh, you're back. Well, if you're so happy you defeated an orc or two, I, <laughs> I, I have destroyed whole villages. You do not understand what I've gone through. You have a long way ahead of you. For once I knew, I'd be, hmm? Lord Knight, forgive this interruption, but there is something I must ask of you. I question whether Queen Lo, Lo, Lotte? Lot? Lot? I don't know how to say this. Truly passed away 15 years past. Tell me, of what cause did she die? Why are you bringing up like a... Okay, this is like, you're just doing your job talking to like... You're at your receptionist desk. Somebody comes in and is like, Hi, I have an appointment for 10 a.m. And then you're like, okay, whatever. And then your coworker comes in and is like, Are birds real? I really doubt that birds are real. And you're just like, excuse me? Who are you? And why do you pry with such inquiries? Please, I've traveled from afar to see her highness. You've what? Very well, listen closely. 15 years ago, Queen Lot fell to a rare sickness. She left this world before we could save her. Oh, he looks, he looks sad. Ah, so an illness claimed her life. Well, it's none of your concern at any rate. Even if she lived, an adventurer like you could never see her, much less the inside of Chateau Doraguile? Doraguile? Uh... What was the name of her illness? We are not told such things. Only the royal family would know. Is that so? Well, I thank you for your kindness, proud knight of Sandoria. Hey, wait! You suspicious person. What was the matter with that adventurer? He was awfully stubborn, wasn't he? he? Seemed to know the late queen personally, but how could he not be aware of her death? Ooh, mystery. At any rate, your work is done. Excellent form, my friend. You were insulting me earlier. You told me I was being too happy about killing an orc or two. Okay, so now, the way the quests work, they go to missions. There are no current missions. Oh. So when when do I get my next, like, story mission? How does this work? <laughs> no markers. Ah, that's too bad. Uh, yeah, I guess it might be hard to visualize 
all of the quest markers. I guess, I guess there might be like too many. Imagine that by yourself at half the leveling rate. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I, I count my blessings. I truly am blessed to be in a XP boosted <laughs> private server. Honestly, it's an amazing game, but it's over 20 years old now, and a lot of things haven't aged super well. Mmm. Sure, the, plus, the sheer amount of content added through the years can be very overwhelming for new players, since there's next to zero hand holding inside the game. As Hesitant Dragon just said, you'll have to be on the wikis a lot. Yeah. Yeah, I literally. I do not know if I would have actually gotten interested in playing another time if people hadn't come in the first stream and been like, oh, like, by the way, like, here's kind of generally how things work. And I'm like, oh. Like, there, there are no quest markers. You have to go into this, like, mysterious side menu to, like, find the things that you're supposed to be doing. <laughs> and, like, it's like, okay, I can, I kind of get my... I kind of see what's happening now. This game came out before WoW. Let that say, I know, yeah. I kind of want to do a WoW stream, too, because that's also another MMO. I, I, I played for, like, a day. But it's also one that I'm not very familiar with, but I'm also, I don't know, kind of curious about the story. And I, I think there's very, like, solo-oriented private servers out there. Uh, it might be fun. I don't know. I want, I want to do a little tour of, like, old old MMO games. Like, ones I've never seen. Doing, doing a little virtual, virtual traveling. Virtual sightseeing. You know what I mean? You've always been curious about EverQuest. Oh, me too! Yeah, that's another one I haven't played before. And I'm sure there's a lot of private servers for that one um, as well. Because that, that, that one's a big one, right? But that one was a little bit... Maybe slight, slightly before my time. I, I have friends who had played it, but it was like a little bit... It was old even, even when I was a kid, I think. Cool. Okay, well, we got our, we got our axe. Um, I guess I'm gonna figure out how to... I'm not entirely sure how to progress the story. We, we learned about some queen who may or may not be dead, which is kind of cool, but it doesn't look like we can pursue that direction anymore. Maybe I, maybe I have to, like, go find that guy and talk to him or something, but um, I think this is a good place to end the stream. Thank you again for coming in, and um, th oh, thank you for the, the Final Fantasy XI people coming in, giving some tips. And, uh, you know, let it, also letting me explore, you know? Like, I, I know it's maybe frustrating to see me like, oh, I don't know what I'm doing, but like, um, I, I appreciate your letting me just kind of have fun and stuff. And, um, but, I, but I also appreciate the tips for some of the stuff that's like kind of hard to figure out. <laughs> uh, but I'm having fun, I don't know. Like, I, I, I kind of like it. I, I have a soft spot for these sort of older, older games. So I'm interested to find out more. I, I might, I, yeah, I might just play this again next week, next Friday. <laughs> uh, we shall see. We shall see. Maybe, maybe, maybe one more time. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll go until it gets, you know, until it gets too repetitive, maybe. Um, but next stream, I will be. Uh, I will not be streaming on Sunday. Um, I got some plans, so no, no art stream on Sunday. And so my next stream will be on Tuesday, and we'll be back with Rune Factory Three. So if you're interested in that, I will see you then. Um, streaming at a similar time then, 8.30 p.m. Pacific time. <laughs> just one more time! Just give me a little bit, one more time! Um, just noticing that you're Tartar. Yeah! I want, to be a, I want it to be a little potato. Potato guy. Um, but yeah, I'll be, I'll be streaming against Tuesday, Rune Factory 3. Um, so I'll see you then. Uh, otherwise, have a good rest of your weekend, all. Uh, let me see if... Uh, is there anyone to raid right now? Who's online right now? Uh... Oh, Melodica streaming. Okay, let's go. Let's go raid Melodica again. <laughs> they are playing. What are they playing? Frog Monster. I do not know what that is, but uh, Melodica is a really cool person. I highly recommend watching them. They're they are a good time. So we'll we'll start the raid over there, and then I will. Uh go to my outro screen. Where's my, where my thingy? Okay, I'll go to my outro screen. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you, and have a good weekend. See you later. Bye.